righty then welcome in hello session 43 it's persona time baby we're back at it we're here this is uh we're not we're not doing any uh announcements this week we're not saying hellos hello hello everybody Hello. Um, because we were doing this ahead of time. Woo, from the future. Actually, from the past. Ooh, from, the past. <laughs> from the past to the future. <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, we're, we're doing that today. Um, for all of those who are watching, probably not because you're either behind or you're not watching this live whenever we air it. But if you are live when you're airing it, today is August 10th. Although today is actually August 6th. Anyway... <laughs> Specifics. Semantics. <laughs> Semantics. <laughs> uh, anyway, we're here to play Persona D and D, baby. Oh my gosh. Woo. Yeah, woo, woo, woo. Yeah, woo. Let's we, hear it. We didn't want to go a session without everybody here, yeah. and, and yeah. we were just like, quickly, "All right, we're doing quickly. this early." Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, for context, people watching this, I am out of town uh, when we were originally planning to do session. Mm -hmm. And since it's so close after we just came back after our break, everybody was kind enough to be like, why don't we just record it? So that way Zeth doesn't have to miss out on it. I'm mm -hmm. just over here like, ah! <laughs> so. Yeah. Being down a player always sucks. And then, yeah. you know, the thought of, well, why don't we just like cancel session was also like a, <gasps> no, <laughs> please like, no. <laughs> you know. We just were on a month break, please. Yeah. And so. not after what happened last time. Yeah, we can't leave on our totally Yes, yeah, Cyrus got some stat yeah. points. Yeah. Yeah, Cyrus <laughs> died again for the second time. He's now tied with Avraf for the amount of deaths. Yeah. Avraf got some ass. Yeah. <laughs> he got some ass points. Yeah. He's got some ass in that spin, baby. Points. And that's all that happened. Yep. Nothing <laughs> else happened. Honestly, Seth, got, was Seth won a strength contest for, against himself. That was yeah. honestly, no that was honestly the whole session. Died. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, no, literally just Zeph went, yeah. not Zeph, Cyrus just went <laughs> and just rubbed his hands together. It was like, give me the fucking Furby. Mm -hmm. The long Furby. Honest, honestly, I didn't even know what it was. So, you know, that Furby probably has puke on it now that I'm thinking about it. Probably. I mean, honestly, so in, <laughs> in context, you can actually thank uh, Shigo for the fact that it exists in this world. Of course um however you're you, so welcome besties you can you can thank me that it's not actually called a long furby in this world. thank god it's not called a long what furby. was it called again a koya bee koya bee it is part of the zodiac however it is it oh, sure is no. it's part of the zodiac yep sure is and it oh, is god, integral to zested <laughs> sure is it me sure sticking is. a huge middle finger up to zane <laughs> Well, oh I wouldn't. I wouldn't allow it to be from her home nation because I didn't want Flair to know about them, so she could be obsessed with them. So oh. I said, you know what? It's from Zested, and if Flair ever comes across them, then by all means, you can have you your know, have your fill of the the long Furbies. But she didn't react when the Koibis came up, so we're safe, gamers. We're good. Let's go. <laughs> we're safe. <laughs> But in, in fairness, in fairness, Flair mightn't be all that into them. She might be like a bit whatever about them. However, Avarif, since it's their native bird. <laughs> no, it is a mythical, it is a mythical creature from the <laughs> It's, 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 it's quote unquote mythical. It's on so their, it's their flag. <laughs> So it may or may not be real, wink, mm -hmm. wink. Just wink, like how wonk. penguins aren't real, wink, wink. wink, wink. Yep. But it's, wink, it's wink. like how some, some wink, nations wonk, have wink. a unicorn on their coat of arms. Zested has the Koyabi on their flag, in their palaces. I'm just making shit up right now. But... Yeah, I was I mean, going to say, I was shaking his head. I was like, you're pulling shit out of your ass there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> totally. Oh, I'm just now realizing seeing all of these custom roles in uh in the the role history. Mm -hmm. What? What role history? <laughs> oh wow, what that, that there's a lot about? of custom roles here. Oh my gosh. What are you talking about? 
a little Flare Clarissime uh, last night was doing a lot of uh, a lot of checks as well. Was bum, she? Bum, bum. Bum, mm -hmm. bum, bum. Yeah, mm, I wonder what that could mean. Smile. Who knows? No, that no, we'll no, I, no. The 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 rolls were. Uh, yeah, that was that was something that I was I was there for as well. It wasn't anything like crazy. I know. Yeah. No. I mean, you were there it's for one role. I was there for a couple. Uh, there were, is another roll yeah. at morning, our uh, Pacific time that was made. So. Yeah. There was yeah, there was a different. So you were there when I rolled the ninety-seven. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, the other rolls are something else. Okay. Anyways. Okay. Chat will, chat will find out. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> it's... Go for it, Dashing. <laughs> I already said it was Persona time. Do it again! <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. God damn it. It's Persona time. time. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Yay! There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. <laughs> So, last time on Persona D&D, &D. Uh, you guys started the Fire Festival. Congratulations. Uh, <laughs> it was, uh, you know, a slow start, a nice, easy start. You guys um, were seemingly excited about the prospect of a martial arts tournament uh, with Avareth and Cyrus, both signing up for it. Um, while you were at that, uh, that big top tent, um, Flair, you were attracted at the prospect of being a horse rider jockey for the horse racing. Mm -hmm. um, Avrif, you signed up for the martial arts tournament under Mr. Fister. And uh, <laughs> Cyrus, under you, Raven, yeah. you signed under, under Raven. And Flair, you chose to be the jockey for Special Week. And not Saint Artos. <laughs> so sad. Not Maybe if you chose Saint Artos, you would have won. In, uh... Uh, plus, and I would have won. Yeah. No, I already, you... I already, I did win. I mean, Flair she did won. win. So, she yeah. did. I know you would have won more handedly, maybe. Oh, uh, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, she wasn't trying <laughs> until she saw Seth screaming yeah. at her. <laughs> After the first leg, there was like, oh shit. <laughs> oh wait, mm -hmm. I'm racing. <laughs> Um, anyway, <laughs> so, yeah, you guys, uh, you guys had fun. You did some lizard racing, you did, uh, the regular gauntlet, you did the test of strength. Um, Avrif, you got some ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the fucking yeah, yeah. Mr. Fister probably did some fisting that wow. day. No, Cease. Cease. No. Abort mission. Fade the black. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, uh, we definitely faded the black on that one. I got you, Chad. Um, I got you. We totally didn't trip press him to roll to see how she'd be, uh, you know, how she felt afterwards. Less than satisfied. Anyway. Less than satisfied. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, anyways, after the, uh, test of strength and the gauntlet, um, Flair, you took part in the horse racing competition, and like we had mentioned before, you won. Congratulations. Uh, Rinko had met up with you at this point and revealed that she bet a fuckload of money on you and won a fuckload of money. Uh... She wouldn't have that... told her that she'd bet money if, if she was. Strength. Yeah, <laughs> you did. Yeah, you did the test. Oh yeah, you did the test of strength again. Because <laughs> yeah. Flair, Flair wanted retribution for uh, yep. for absolutely blowing it before. After and... both Cyrus and Scent got twice. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And then, uh, and then it was time for the drinking competition. Uh, Avrif, during this time, you were done getting some ass, and uh, mm -hmm. you and Sharina headed towards the festival to spend, you know, the remainder of your Friday evening together in the fa uh, fairgrounds. Uh, you went to the Hall of Illusions, where you began to hallucinate quite vividly, um, only to be literally pulled into a mirror by an evil version of yourself, uh, who very quickly took your place and uh headed to the drinking competition 
to single someone out. And oh by god, they did. Because Flair, congratulations, you won the drinking competition. Only to be brutally... <laughs> Here it comes. Brutally murdered by evil Avrif. Um, Avrif, you were able to find your way out of this mirror realm with the, hang the Hanks. The thanks of uh, the master, Kinden. And uh, while you were searching for Flair, and while Kin was searching for Flair, he happened upon the evil version of yourself, telling you that you would no longer be needing this, and he killed it in what seemed like an instant. Uh, splitting up to look for Flair, Kin was seen shortly thereafter, carrying what looked like a limp body back to his domain, entering a room and closing it with you it's kind of standing on the other side of the door and he said your services were no longer required and that is where we ended game gamers that is where we are starting game gamers um avarith what are you <laughs> Um, I am staring at this closed door in front of me and, and for about 10 seconds, his eyes are just staring at this and his mind going at thousands of miles per hour in a crazed fanatic emotions go over him. And after that time, he just turns stoic and very very stiffly almost like a military routine walks his way back to his room okay actually well now that i'm here actually i could do my plan uh he'll be walking to his room but he'll he'll ring the bell okay you go ahead Sorry, I just have food in my mouth right when now. Uh, right when we got to this part. How dare okay, you? Mm -hmm. How dare you? Gage shows up and he's uh, eating a piece of uh, bread. Oh, Master Ever. <laughs> <laughs> How can I help you? Uh, your quarters tonight. Would we be able to go speak in them? If um, you think we need to. I would uh, really appreciate that. All right. We'll and head over uh, to his place. Head over to his uh, servant quarters, which aren't far from yours because he is your servant. So you get there, bada bing, bada boom, you're there. Uh, is anyone else in this? Is this just like his quarters, pure and pure outer one? It is like a, like a, a New York apartment, you know, like one of those almost shoebox rooms oh god because <laughs> he's a that servant they don't need a guy. lot okay uh, i'm gonna close the door behind me and mm -hmm. kind of just make sure we're we're not being followed we're peering out the, the door make a, make a perception check okay. you're good cool. you think you're good I th <laughs> nice sporting change there. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice, like that. Um, yeah, I mean, unless my passive perception sees anything now, but no. close the door um, and I'll kind of just walk over to the nearest chair and, and then kind of wave to Gage to sit down on the bed. He does so. The people, did anyone knew I mean? The first name that rings to them is the Failure Prince. Each and every single time without skipping a beat, that's what it is. I tried introducing myself to a family I didn't know. Even they only knew me as the Failure Prince. And it seems like every action I take proves that name right. I know it wasn't me that killed her, but it, it, it was a part of me. I don't 
fully understand it. But I saw my first master, the one that taught me so much about this world and that was taken way too soon. And I saw my father and my sister and my brother. I saw, I saw Dane. But I'm starting to think, after all this time, the only person who's not haunting me is you. And I cracks a smile. <laughs> <laughs> so I wanted to thank you. Again, I know we've had these conversations, but your support is greatly appreciated. Well, Master Avarif, through thick or thin, unequivocally, I am on your side. What do I do, Gage? I, every step I take seems to be burning behind me, and everyone that follows or is near me is burnt. I... I don't know anymore. He's gonna kind of like look down at the floor, just staring very pensively at it. Mm -hmm. At a one just specific spot. He reaches out and he pats you on the shoulder. I cannot give you the answer for which you're looking for. I can't say that I know exactly what you're going through, although I have a fairly decent thought on your circumstances I've witnessed through our many years together. Keep moving forward. Sometimes that's all you can do. I think that is my only option, but maybe, maybe I will be a little bit more cautious. Although I love the fun aspect of how I live now, I, I don't think it's sustainable anymore. I kind of like look at him with his very determined eyes and just stare right into him and just mm -hmm. I think it's time to get more real he's gonna stand up reach his hand out for like a like a brotherhood shake with Gage mm -hmm. and if reciprocated he'll kind of go in for like one of those hugs yeah he'll take it Well, if you find anything more with your information, I would like to know more about Ophelia. If you hear anyone speak her name or have any clues on her, let me know. Very well. All right, Gage. You take care. Good night. I'll start walking back to his room. To your room? Okay. Because <laughs> you were yeah, in yeah, my room. room. Yeah. I mean, well, yeah, back to my room. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, do like a quick 360. All right, uh, Gage, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> get out of my room, Gage. Get yeah. the fuck out of here. Okay. And you can find yourself off to a pensive but relaxing night's sleep, knowing what is coming for you tomorrow with the martial arts tournament. Uh, one sec. Your uh, your video died for a second. Dashing, I'm fixing it. Video died. Yeah, hang on. Oh. Sorry. Right. <laughs> it was just it just died for like two seconds. All good now. All good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Where? Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you have just won the drinking competition. Congratulations. <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> Woo. 
Thank goodness for that constitution I got. Well, beat out Rinko and uh, Cyrus. Hey, I'll take second place. Yeah. Surprisingly, Rinko lost. Anyway. <clears throat> Flair. Yeah. Yes. The last thing that you remember very clearly was walking up to the drinking competition stage. Mm -hmm. You very vaguely remember winning. You barely even remember who was present on the drinking stage with you. Yeah. You very briefly remember that Avrif was there at all. It seems like he was just uh, almost like a fever dream in presence at that competition. However, you do have a light memory of stumbling through the fairgrounds with the assistance of somebody. <laughs> However, there is one scene that is very stark in your memory. And it is the sadistic smile of Avrif with his hands around your throat. Yep. Other than that, you ain't got shit. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> but after that memory of that face with the pressing in of your esophagus in your throat, Darkness, pure darkness, overtakes you. It's extremely cold, although you almost can't feel anything. Like, it's like you're going numb with how cold it is. And for a moment, you start to panic realizing that you're no longer breathing. But then you begin to get the sensation that there's no pressure for you to breathe any longer. The only thing that you can feel is how cold it is. How dark it is. You think for a moment you're dreaming. There's no other explanation. You must have really drank that hard that you can't move because you're just that drunk. Like, it's gotta be it. Maybe Rinko accidentally left the window open. And that's why it's so cold, but you can't seem to get up or open your eyes to look for the window. What are you doing? I guess just gonna try and reach a hand out. Okay. Try and move anything. You go ahead and try to move fingers, toes, arms, neck, head, hope move your eyelids. Nothing is responding. It's almost like you're in a static position, just in complete darkness. But you have the sensation that you're floating. Flying through what feels like nothingness. Like you're on a cloud, almost. Unable to do anything. And it feels like you're being consumed into the darkness, into the oblivion of nothingness. And you float on in this for what seems like forever for you, until you see a light in the distance 
then you begin to see more specks of light in the distance, almost like a sky full of stars. The first light to breach your eyes, the sensation even more so that you're floating through space, very much carrying your existence. You still feel this cold sensation as it becomes more and more prevalent. As it begins to crest your face like you're breaching water, and suddenly you begin surge of air fill you. And as this happens, you feel two hands on the like top part of your shirt begin pulling at you, almost like you're being dragged. Confused, probably, about what is going on. <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> uh, maybe a, a little, uh, yeah, <laughs> confused. I was confused. Very <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, very, very um, unsure about the sensation of what is going on. You realize that you're being dragged out of what is a, like a roaring current onto a small sandbar. This still freezing cold, looking up at the stars is all you can see. And this figure pulling at you gets you up onto this beach and it pats you on the shoulder lightly. While you're laying on your back, it sort of leans into your gaze. It's almost dysmorphic and unclear as this residual water is pouring into your eyes from your hair clouding your vision completely. The figure doesn't say anything, but it begins to move, almost as if it's taking off a coat, and it lays it over you. Like your torso area. Hmm. And it sits back and does nothing. What are you doing? She's going to uh, try and get the water out of her eyes and turn and see who's there. Okay. You begin to wipe away the, the water from your eyes. Um, it seems like the water is um, easy enough to wipe away. Uh, you do it rather quickly uh, with the assistance of the goat even um, to get some sort of dryness because you're soaked. Um... And as you look over, your vision becoming more and more clear. Your gaze begins to meet someone that you haven't seen in an extremely long time. You're meeting the gaze of your father. Yeah. And before you even get a chance to react, this sudden realization on your face is a sudden realization on his, and he is jumping forward and pulling you in tightly for this massive bear hug that you haven't felt in years. What are you doing? Um, Flair's arms just clasp around him so tightly. Mm -hmm. And she doesn't even know how to like cry because you know she she she's just so happy to see him but yeah everything around her there's uh can i say that she's got a a sense that that she uh she kn she knows that this isn't good. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you can definitely have a sense that, like, why, like, what is going on? Like, why are you here? Why am I here? What's like, you know, confusion, yeah. on yeah. uncertainty, for sure. Yeah, and she's just kind of, but she's kind of just melting mm -hmm. into the moment at that point, and. And there's not a lot of thoughts going through. It's just sort of like 
yes, this is it and this is what it is. And she just holds him tightly mm -hmm. for whatever moments that she has with him right now. Yeah, and um, he won't say anything, but he will just embrace you for as long as you embrace him. Eventually, um, after after a while, she will kind of catch her breath a bit, or mm -hmm. her real breath, and say, so sorry, Daddy. I... I never meant... to put you at risk. He... gives you a very soft smile. And, um, he looks at you and he shakes his head. No. No. You... You never once put me at risk for anything. For anything. I need to apologize to you for you ever ending up in any sort of situations that would put you at risk. It's okay. I, I've learned to handle myself and protect everyone else around me too. Father, is Cain here? Do you, have you, is he okay? He gives you a, almost like he cocks his head to the side. I just want him to know that I'm sorry too, and Sorry for what? I... I don't know what kind of disagreement you might have had with your brother, but... I haven't seen him a single time since I've been here. You mean you... You didn't... come to see him when he passed? I... If he's here, then I have not found him. How did you find me? Are you... I had a feeling. I was being pulled in a direction. Told I needed to be somewhere. And as I came here, I saw you coming down the river. Can you pull me out? <laughs> yes. But... Thank you. What are you doing here? I... It's far too early for you. I... I would have thought so too, but I... I guess... Well, I, I found out that I... I suppose death's been sniffing at my heels for a while now, and maybe... It's just caught up to me, but I, I don't understand what happened. Your aunt hasn't done something to you, has she? My aunt? I... I... I mean, I, I don't think so, but what... Why... Why would you... Do you know something about her? Is... Because I... I mean, I know that even when you were around, she was, she was weird, but was she always, is she, is, is she, your mother okay? I, I'm not sure. I haven't seen her for a while. Do you believe that she might be in some sort of danger? Well... Not that I believe that she would be in danger, but I've always just worried about her if anything were to happen to me. Yeah. 
When you spend so long with somebody, it, it can be difficult sometimes moving on. Not to be vain, but your mother and I were together for a very long time. Mm. We were all lost without you, Dad. Everything fell to pieces without you, and I've I've tried to keep it all together, but... Cain didn't help you? He Dane? He tried. Dane... Dane had a lot of his own demons to fight, I suppose. I think, you know, there, there was something with Auntie got into his head in more ways than one. <sighs> well, if that's how it is, I suppose. It surprises me a little bit that Kane wouldn't come back after the hospital visit and just take over. The hospital visit? After he got sick? But he... 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 he died, Dad. Cocks his head again. No. What do you mean? He's... He's not here anymore. That's why I... I had to... I had to hold everything. I had to be there for Mom and... You know, he... He died from his illness. Is he... If he was dead... Then he would be here. Somewhere. And maybe then I haven't found him. But... If that's the case, then... Surely he would have been pulling towards you as well. Not just me. Yeah. Yeah, sh surely he... He, he adored you, right? Flair. There is no way that he would not want to save you from that current. Yeah. I miss you, and I miss him every day. But if... If what you're saying is true, if there's a, a chance he might... He might be alive? He has to be. Oh. And... So, I got, I gotta, fuck, I gotta find him, but I'm, I'm here now, I, there's nothing more I can do. No. It's, it's still too early for you to stay. What do you mean, there's, is there a way back, like, am I? And he begins to look up, and you begin to hear the flapping of wings. And you see in the distance the shimmering scales of platinum grow larger and larger as Bahamut lands on the other side of the river. looking at you. Wait, but... you can't come with me, can you? And he shakes his head. So I, this is it. I this need is to stay here. We get. This is all the time we get? Unfortunately, and he cups your face. I'll be here. When your time is over in that world, we have eternity together. Pinky promise. 
He reaches up and Pinky promises back to you. <laughs> okay. And he, he looks over at Bahamut and he says, Bahamut, it sure has been a while. I was wondering when you would come and fetch Flair. And Bahamut begins reaching his long neck across the river. And he sort of lowers it to the ground as if for you to get aboard him. And he says, Hello, old friend. I have not forgotten my promises. What? And uh, your father <laughs> begins to laugh. And he turns to you, Flair, and gives you another big bear hug. <laughs> and he scoops you off your feet and begins to carry you over to Bahama and places you on top of his snout and onto his head. She's gonna squeeze him really tightly. Mm -hmm. And before he lets go, and um, she's gonna, as she's climbing up, she's gonna hold onto his hand and look into his eyes. See, I promise I'll make sure our family is safe. And I'm gonna do everything I can make use of the time that I have left. <laughs> he smiles and uh, he takes a step back and he raises up a hand as if to wave goodbye. As Bahamut begins to retract, you watch as your father begins to fade away. And he says, goodbye, Flair. Take care of your brothers for me. Also, watch over your mother. Try not to let anybody from Azatar or your aunt near her. And I know Kane and Dane are always going to be there for you. So just remember you're never alone, even though I'm not there anymore. Oh, and remember, but... And he vanishes. That? And Bahamut finishes retracting and begins flying away into the night sky. And you hear, It's not yet time, Flair. Time to come back. I wasn't ready to say goodbye to him yet. And you open your eyes saying that. You open your eyes while you're saying that. You're in a warm bed. There's a fire crackling. Not sure where you are in the moment, but you look over and you see the master sitting in a chair, asleep. Feels like you have a bit of a hangover. <laughs> a bit. You telling me that dying doesn't cure it. Hangovers? <laughs> Fuck. No, it doesn't, bro. Oh, no. So don't go yeah, testing it yourself. Yeah. Wicked God, headache. It. Gotta be the worst wicked fucking head. hangover of your life. <laughs> what are you doing, Flair? Well, she's gonna wake up and she's got, like... She feels, like, a wetness on her face. Mm-hmm. And she rubs her eyes, and there's like tears yeah. in her eyes. And she, um, how far, far is the master? Is he arm length? He is like, if he could be sitting on the bed, he would be with how close the chair is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's gonna reach an arm out. Mm hmm. And, um, gently kind of call to him mm -hmm. he uh very gingerly opens his eyes and looks down at you I have a rough dream you could rubs say his that. eyes but what happened and she goes to sit up, but, you know, oh. the wicked headache kicks <laughs> yeah. in. And she's yeah, 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 yeah. Nope. <laughs> you, uh, seem to have, uh, had a lot to drink last night. And you came to the wrong room. 
the wrong room? Came to my room. And I, I, I'm sorry, I. Okay. Did I, I looked after you while you slept and uh, seems like you got the better night of sleep than I did. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm sorry if I was a, a bother. I, I just, I did, how much, how much did I drink? Cause I think I, Yeah, I think I had a really weird dream. Did I? Di I didn't die, did I, Master? <laughs> now, why would you go and think something like that? Just, just weird dreams. <clears throat> People saying it's not my time and all, all that. You I were calling out to. Your father. Y yeah. Has it been yeah. lonely without him? It has been. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. I I won't burden you with that. I um. <clears throat> I can. Uh, I can, uh, see myself back to my room, and she tries to get up again, kind of <laughs> straining against the pain. <laughs> he puts his arm out and he presses down on your shoulder and says, Lay down for a bit longer, I'll get you something to drink to ease the pain. But and it's he, okay, you don't have he, to trouble yourself. He gets up and he, um, walks over and he begins to make you a cup of tea. It won't exactly get rid of the headaches, but it does the trick. And he hands you the cup. Thank you. She, um, she sits up like just enough to take a sip. <laughs> mm -hmm. And you hiccup from it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, that was in character. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so um, you drink your tea. Mm -hmm. Very good. Soothes the dryness in your throat, the some of the headache that you were experiencing. Uh, you s hit your shin on something. That was, uh, <laughs> <laughs> that was my knee. You hit your knee on something. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I'm just uh, method acting the pain. <laughs> perfect, perfect. That's what we like to see. And uh, whenever you are ready to get up and out of bed, you can do so. Um. Yeah. Once once she's soothed, she she's gonna sit upright. Is the master still there? Yeah, yeah. He's um sitting in a a different chair across the room, reading a book. Yeah. She's going to, a. Uh, she'll sit up and like, you know, take a second to get mm -hmm. her wits about her and her balance. She's just going to be like rubbing the back of her neck. Be like, wow, it's weird of a hangover coming from there, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then, uh, and then she's going to look over at him and she'll be like uh, uh sorry I uh sleep talk I <laughs> it's a bit embarrassing I just I had some uh well yeah I dreamt of my father and he he was saying something uh, actually about uh looking after my mother and um and actually could 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 
might get you to what what were the places that he said people from something as she a as a tar does she know what as a tar is it is a city state in oscar okay she, okay she knows that all right mm -hmm. okay um as a tar um mm -hmm. okay and what sorry what was the other thing people from as and your aunt and okay and aurelius okay yeah mm -hmm. um yeah um he was he said something about being careful of my aunt and people from Azatar. Clicks his tongue. <sighs> you eavesdropping on my conversations, are you? <laughs> what? I. What? Were you in the room? I'm only kidding. That? Is that why I dreamed about it? No. Oh. Okay. But yes. Try not to trust too many people from Mazatar. Ties to Ophelia can be dangerous. Ophelia? Mm hmm. Ophi Wait. Ophelia. That's. That's who Dane was talking about. Correct. I, okay. And she's from Azatar. What does she have to do? Why would she want to hurt my mother? <sighs> because of our aunt. They're our? Aunt. Aurelius. Did you? That was my mistake as dashing, not, uh. Oh, our... okay. It's... I mean, because Dane, Dane. Dane because we were talking about Dane yeah, yeah, with Aurelius. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just, Dane a fucking and Claire. anvil just a slip. A slip. <laughs> Good God. Like, the fucking family members all around here are just like... <laughs> yeah. Hello, daughter. Hello, brother. Hello, sister. It, Hello, auntie. <laughs> it's what you yeah. sometimes. That's all good. Yes. Sure. Your I aunts. believe you. Your aunts. My aunt. <laughs> <Your> aunt. <laughs> I've, all right, I'm good. I'm good. I just had to recover. I was just like, what? You're good. No, <laughs> that was me making a mistake. Okay. <laughs> that was me misspeaking. Oh, good. Oh, good. Damn mm. it, you and your red herrings. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. Damn um, me and my inability to speak English. <laughs> um. Yeah, she's she's just gonna nod and be like, okay. Uh. Yeah, I, I, was it like a prophetic dream? Do you know anything about dreams, Master? <sighs> Just that sometimes that they can play out. Sometimes visions of the future that won't come to pass. So I should... It's your subconscious heart at work. Right. Okay. And, uh... She's going to, um... She's going to pick herself up and then mm -hmm. bow in front of him. And... Her hair falls in front of her face. All of it now white. And she's going to say thank you for watching over me, Master. Sorry for the inconvenience. No inconvenience. Have a fun day at the festival, Flair. Uh, thank you, sir. And then she'll walk out. <laughs> okay. Easy enough. Uh, as you walk out, you begin descending the stairs. You notice the cherry blossom tree is dead. <laughs> you would. <laughs> and he's so nonchalant about it. <laughs> you know um, shit's killed... serious when there's he... a change in the environment, bro. He killed a tree. <laughs> he couldn't take care of a tree. <laughs> She's gonna walk over to it mm -hmm. and like 
run her fingers over it mm -hmm. and just kind of mouth out, poor little thing. And, uh, yeah, she's just going to touch it a bit. Okay. Um, and then she'll, she'll, uh, she'll leave. Very cool. No one walks in on her doing that. <laughs> no. Um, Sam I'm... walks in. <laughs> yeah, Sam walks in. Oh my god. Leo yeah, no, walks uh, in and is just like, die. <laughs> <laughs> Not again. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you begin to walk out of the master's domain. Um, your brother's domain. <laughs> I'm just... um, stop. <laughs> you ran at me. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so you walk out of the master's domain and, um, uh, you see Faye and Rinko in the library eating breakfast. Um, and Rinko turns and sees you and gives you a head nod and goes, well, wasn't that a night of drinking? I don't want to do that again for a while. Flair kind of slumps very heavily into the chair. She's got like, she's very Bambi legged mm -hmm. and she's just like, never again, <laughs> never drinking again, period. Faye kind of looks up at you and says, me too, sister. I, I don't think I can look at another drink ever again. That was too much for me. <laughs> right pretty sure this hangover almost killed me. And she, then she's gonna get like a very serious look on her face as she's like staring at a fixed point on the floor, like mm -hmm. cons reconsidering that. And she's, <laughs> and she's like, yeah, I think that, I think that almost killed me. <laughs> <laughs> and then she's just gonna snap back to be like, so uh, hangover cure? Huh. Rinko smiles and says, my hangover cure is more alcohol. Nope. Faye, any ideas? Faye kind of puts her hands up and says, I think we just got to deal with it till it goes away. <sighs> I'm not experienced yeah. with this stuff. I don't know what you want from me. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I, uh... Has anyone... Uh, Rinko, have you seen my brother lately at all? Kind of looks over at you and uh, takes a sip of her drink. And she says, Dane? Mm -mm. I haven't been over there. Well, actually, no, I was there yesterday. So, yes, I did see him yesterday. Yeah, okay. I, uh, I go and pay him a visit. Do you want me to uh, come with you, or...? Oh, I mean, yeah, if you if you both want to come, unless you're, you know, nursing your hangover here in the quiet, I understand completely. <laughs> <laughs> I do the same. Faye smiles and says, um, you guys can go on ahead with me. I think I'm gonna probably, uh, find Abby and just, uh, take it easy for a little while today. Uh, Flair's gonna suddenly shudder. <laughs> <laughs> and she's just not going to acknowledge what Faye said. Mm -hmm. And she's gonna look a little bit, uh, like she's recoiling in her seat. <laughs> mm -hmm. And suddenly go a bit, maybe, white and queasy looking. <laughs> could be the hangover, could be... Mm -hmm. Bad dreams. <laughs> Yeah. Um, and then she's just gonna get up, <laughs> give a curt smile to Faye, and then wrap her arm, like, into Lockout with Rinko and start walking. Head off, yep. Yep. All right. And you do. Avrif, Cyrus, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> wow! The 
fact that they both had the same energy. Too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's called being in character. It's, yeah, this it is. <laughs> okay. Uh, what are you guys doing? What's going on? As, as uh, soon as Cyrus is like getting up, I'm assume I'm gonna assume he was like just face planted in his bed. Oh yeah, absolutely. He's, gonna just like lift himself up and then just like his head's gonna fall into his hands and just be like oh god uh, can Aberth at this point <laughs> uh, can Aberth at this point already be like pretty much dressed yeah like like he was up a little bit earlier yeah like drinking the morning coffee pretty much Some, yeah yeah totally <sighs> You yeah, I guess Cyrus right. will kind of like wake up to all of Avrath sounds in the kitchen or <laughs> like, Avrath kitchen sounds. <laughs> yeah, the kitchen the way. It's like a little kitchen. Yeah. You know? Nice. I like yeah. this. I didn't know that. That's yeah. fucking sick. I mean, it's a dorm room. Yeah. You know, yeah. they, they, they want to make sure that like we don't have to spend all sorts of money. Mm -hmm. Fair. Um, yeah, he's just going to be there and think, oh, you uh, went head to head with Rinko. Is it some kind of pride thing? Oh, I, in a sense, yeah. <laughs> no, I beat her, though. I remember uh, that much. I remember so getting heard. second place. <laughs> Was it worth it? Probably not, but <laughs> bragging rights, well, I beat Rinko. He's going to put, like, some OJ and, and eggs next to him, be like, you take this and take the morning easy. You, uh, are they still quite eggs? early in the morning. Are they cooked eggs or are they raw eggs? This they are cooked. Why would I give them to you raw? <laughs> well, a hangover cure actually is to just yeah. put like a raw egg in some like OJ True. or something like that. So uh, yeah, no, they're. Cooked, I'm not sure so. if Avril will know that though. No, absolutely not. Avril is, is not a drinker. <laughs> good, 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 good. Uh, yeah, he can I'm... hold his drink, but he don't drink. It's Wait, true. really? I didn't know that about him. No. Well, he drank the one time okay. with Rinko. But mm -hmm. that's beside the point. Yeah. Uh, Cyrus will kind of like shake his head a little bit, just try to kind of like focus his vision, and he'll see the OJ and eggs and be like, "Oh, just hey, I don't mean to to be that guy, but um, I still don't feel 100% comfortable walking around on my own. Could you uh, could you just hold up and you know let me collect myself, and then we can leave together?" Uh, question to DM: What time does the festival open? I mean, it it's never really going. closes. Never closes. Yeah, it's just going. Mm, good to know. Because uh, <laughs> it like is it about like nine a.m. right now? Would you say dashing? Yeah, oh, roughly. Roughly. Okay. okay. Um, how far would it take to get to the festival? I mean, it's like a 20, 25 minute walk from the school. Okay. Well, how about take an hour, just get yourself ready, eat food, water, drink whenever you need. Shower, most definitely. Um, he's gonna kind of look at him very, <laughs> very slowly <laughs> up and down. You need one, maybe two showers. You know, I think I just need a new set of clothes and a nice hot shower. Yeah, please. Um, Do I really I'll be smell back. that bad? No, no, not. Don't fucking bullshit me. I stink, don't I? You were horrible to walk in to. Yes, yeah, I... God, they let me puke on myself, didn't they? Well, to be fair, I think everyone puked on themselves. I, you know, after the competition is, is about as vivid as the winning lottery numbers. They, yeah. they, they don't exist. Well, I mean, I saw, I saw Rinko and Faye, and it looks like they had some, you know... Faye had things. not that many drinks... Well, she had like two. Have you seen her recent? You know, she is quite small. I'm surprised she even attempted to drink. It's not something that I've seen her do actually before. Yeah, I don't know. She's uh, she's something, all right. Anyways, Most uh, definitely. yeah, I'll I'll get ready, but um, yeah, but yeah I, I won't I won't be too long. I'll come fetch you in an hour. Cool. cool. And he's gonna he's gonna leave uh, outside. He's gonna ring his bell immediately, okay, um, and and whisper to Gage wherever Shadow Man is, mm -hmm. and just be like, just make sure no one gets inside here. Understand? And he's gonna walk to the festival. Okay. 
Sent. Hello. Good morning. Morning. You wake up in bed with Bernie. Oh, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> you, the the unicorn is probably sitting opposite of her. <clears throat> yep. She, she's probably like it pro probably what happened he probably rolled the fuck over puked in a trash can and she just cuddled up with the unicorn yeah basically <laughs> probably it yep basically <laughs> yeah he like he's gonna just like his eye his vision is gonna be probably extremely blurry and just like mm -hmm. the whole nine yeah the whole nine he's gonna he's gonna know he's gonna kind of like collect his surroundings be like oh fuck and just and not even like try to like stand up to get out of bed it's just fucking roll over just falls out of bed yeah <laughs> and just and like as you do it kind of jolts bernie awake just, yeah ah, oh yeah oh, he, 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 he'll he'll treat it as like uh like because he'll he'll land face down he'll just do like a push-up to push himself up just be like yeah just waking myself up it's okay He'll just he'll, go, he'll do like two or like like try to do two or three totally fail at it <laughs> <laughs> on the second one just kind of stand up it's just trying to look strong just i did oh. she looks over at oh you. no she's, she's kind of giving you that look <laughs> i'm fine i'm fine I'm fi it's fine i'm fine it's uh he's just gonna look in the mirror at himself <laughs> he looks like fine. shit doesn't he <laughs> yeah oh yeah terrible oh uh you need to take a shower a shower a lot of water um uh, something. Uh. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> do I have an extra pair of clothes here of mine? I'm, I'm not sure. You do. Oh, fuck. Great. Uh, is there a shower in her room? There is. He's, he's just gonna hobble his way over there, like, just yep. swaying the whole time. <laughs> He'll probably knock something, like, like, probably knock one of her plushies over or something, run right into, right into the wall, just like, oh, fuck. Like not really caring too much, but as soon as he like knocks over one of her things, he'd be like, "Oh no, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry." He like pick it back up, put it back on. Go take a shower, silly. Like straightening everything back up. No, no, no. I, I'm so, I'm sorry. I just, I just, okay. <laughs> just kind of go. <laughs> just kind of go into the shower. It's just mm -hmm. he's in there for like probably a half hour or so, just mm -hmm. trying to remember what was going on, trying trying to recollect anything that happened. Um, it's fuzzy. Yeah. <laughs> you remember she came to collect you after you were done drinking. That's about it. <laughs> Did uh, everyone get home safe? Everyone is perfectly fine. Ah, oh, good. Oh, that Sharina girl's very nice. Oh? <laughs> Char Sharina Asuka? Oh, okay, okay. I, just... I mean, I I don't totally know her too well. Well, I mean, you know, she's a princess and all that. But, like, you know, I haven't really gotten to know her all that well. But she's actually really nice. I I didn't even know she was there. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> no, brain's still a little fuzzy. Sorry. How did um, Avarith bag that? They were... <laughs> those two were... What? Th those two? I saw him kissing. Was he drunk? No. Was she drunk? No. Hmm. I, uh... Alright, I mean, good for him, I suppose. Weird, but, uh... Very strange. <laughs> I thought him and Rinko, to be honest, but, uh, alright, sure. Wait, Rinko Yori, really? They, uh, they had some weird things at, at some point, so I, I don't know, maybe. I wasn't sure. You don't think he gets around. I I don't know. Do you, I don't... Think he's too, do you think he's two timing one of them? Maybe. I, huh. I don't want to say, but I mean, could oh. could be. <laughs> oh. my ass. Maybe well, I should talk to Sharina. Like she is our princess. To be fair, if they kiss, her... Rinko was there, wasn't she? She was like drunk off her ass. Maybe she saw them kiss? I, I don't know. Oh. Huh. I don't know. Should I talk to Sharina? Let... Uh, how close are you two? I've talked to our princess maybe like 
twice ever. Let me talk to Avara first, maybe. <laughs> might might be a good idea. <laughs> okay. Is that yeah, sad? All right. Oh, all right. Sure. Uh. <clears throat> okay. Might, might yeah. be best. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, all right. All right. Sure. Um. So, what did you have going on today? Well, first, what first, what did you do yesterday? What were you up to? And he just kind of like finally gets out of the shower, <laughs> like wrapped in a towel, plops down next to her. Yeah. Starts like brushing she, uh, his hair, his mane. She's like putting makeup on and, and getting ready for the day and stuff. And she's like, well, I was doing some, you know, fair stuff yesterday. And then I signed up for that martial arts tournament, actually. So right. okay. I'm excited to partake in that. Um, Athos says I have a really good shot to make it pretty far. So I'm, I'm reasonably sure I'll be all right. Well, you might be going against Saturday Sword Avertef as well. So uh... <laughs> I'm not worried about either of them. They both play Glimpse. Damn! What the fuck? I mean, Never. shit! I saw Save you. your fucking life or whatever, and this is how you treat me? Okay. Yeah, unsung hero. Okay, you know what? You know what's fine. It's not like Cyrus had the foresight to make sure that she didn't die in her own palace or anything like that. God, I missed my necklace I already. I missed that plum necklace already. Damn. Okay. Guess I'm... I'll fucking just eat shit. I mean, I saw you kick Sinna's ass, so, you know, it it's, could be possible. And she was a really big lion lady. Yeah. So, like, you know, like, I'm pretty confident. Honestly, at this point, from what, from how I've seen you training, you might be able to even take take my brother. Mm. Well, Maybe. You, you would stand good against him. I mean, I... I I'm not gonna lie to you, I actually threw him over my shoulder. <gasps> Holy shit, okay. <laughs> <clears throat> he didn't want me to tell anybody that, but it happened. Oh, I'm <sighs> gonna use this against him so badly. <laughs> <laughs> He's but... been teaching me some self defense moves, you know, like use mm -hmm. their opponent's body weight against them mm -hmm. type of stuff. So it's, you know, it's been going all right. Okay. So you worked a little, at, a little at the grounds. You you mm -hmm. signed up for the event. Uh, mm -hmm. Any anything else, or was it just kind of just just kind of roaming the roaming everything? Well, I looked around a little bit with Alessandra, and then that's when I saw you, and I asked for some time away, and then I found out you were drunk. So yeah, sorry about that. It's fine. Although it... you've never hugged me so tightly before. <laughs> I, I I had a good day. Okay, I mean, mm -hmm. you know. Ne ne never? Really? I don't think so. You were pretty clingy. You're not a very clingy person, you know. Kind of clingy when I'm drunk, sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's alright. I'm not complaining. <laughs> alright, duly noted. Be more clingy. Got it. <laughs> um, I won a strength, uh, strength contest, though. Like a test of strength. You won a test of strength contest? I know! No, take it rudely. I, I will take it completely rudely. That's how I won that. He points over the unicorn. <laughs> oh, well. Applause to you. I, uh... The question stands, though. What do you got going on today? Uh, well, I'm going to be watching the, 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 the martial arts competition. So... Okay. I'll be seeing that. But, uh, other than that... Need to check in on everybody. Make sure they're all okay. But I think we'll probably just meet up at some point. So, should be fine. Um, well, I mean, I was about to start heading over to the fairgrounds. If you know you want to go get and play teat at the fair, sure. Um, there was another thing too. Um, what question to DM? What time was that dancing competition again? It was in the evening, right? Uh, yes. What yes. are you? So, what what are you doing in the evening? Uh, well, assuming I don't absolutely get my shit rocked in that fighting tournament, nothing. <laughs> okay, Sarah's so gonna rock her shit now. <laughs> well, I'm petty. Well, don't don't get your shit rock because there's a dancing competition. And I need a partner. Oh. Well, you know I already have my dancing shoes. Perfect. Bring them. I will. <laughs> I'll uh, even bring a nice dress. Ah, oh, shit! We're dressing up, aren't we? Yeah, give you a smile. Don't worry. I'll I'll pick something out for you. 
you always know the best mm-hmm. for me. So uh, we'll be matching. Perfect. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, we can. Um, whenever you're all ready, I uh, I just need to throw something together until uh, until then. Unless you want to just go in whatever we're wearing. I mean, you're gonna have to armor up, but uh, well, there's some time from when the the martial arts ends and the dancing competition begins. So cool. we'll have time to change and stuff like that. Good point. How how fancy are you gonna make me? How fancy are we going here? Because uh, I mean, don't worry about it. I'm worrying now. Don't you, worry about you know, it. You know I don't do fancy. Don't worry about it. I'm worried. Good. Let's go. All right. He's he's gonna just fi- kind of find like a like just like a summer like 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 a nice like light white top of his, and then probably just some slacks and just take that with him out. Mm-hmm. Like something something comfortable and breathable. It's fucking. He's he's still like he's he's gonna he's gonna get a headache if he wears something too warm. <laughs> yeah, for sure. But uh, yeah, they'll go and they'll go and find some food. Probably another like quick little 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 coffee date and just talk nonsense. All right, and you can. Uh, um, on the way to the fairgrounds, you do spot Avrith. He'll he'll uh he'll he'll flag him down. Okay, Avrith, you see uh, Scent flagging you down on the way into the festival. Uh, he's gonna give like a, a slight salute to the head and keep walking forward. All right, yeah, he'll uh, he'll kind of just grab Bernie by the hand and kind of kind of rush along and catch up with him. So catch uh, up to Avrith. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So uh, good morning. How are you feeling? Good morning. Uh, fine. <laughs> Seems like you guys all had one quite night. I uh, definitely needed a li- little, little, little more to, to wake myself up, but uh, I'm okay. Uh, did you? Uh, did kind of look at Bernie. <laughs> look back She's, at you. She smiles. <laughs> yeah. Oh, gotcha. Are you two timing, Sharina? Oh. He's in a very blankly Sorry, stare and then I blink. Couldn't hold uh, it in. Um, sense, you and Rinko Yori. Just frog blinking. <laughs> You know, he's looking back to him and her. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he, you know, he, he just like st- he's just staring off into space now, frog blinking, just like oh. <laughs> I, saw, I saw you making out with Trina, Oscar, and then Sen yes. told me that you know we, you and you Rinko you were pretty close, so I just don't want to make sure that you're not doing anything untoward with those girls apparently it was at the drinking competition that you were you were at right uh yeah yeah i i I, yeah (laughs) yeah i was i was making out with her there yeah i uh you okay i guess i just didn't remember yeah sorry it's a weird morning um okay i know is the answer to that no i'm rinko hates my guts and I haven't really spoken to her in a, a while. Okay, um, that's a relief. Well, not that she hates you, but oh, okay. that's a relief that you're not too tiny, anybody. No, no, I, not, uh, not to my knowledge, at least. It wasn't because of the thing with Sharina, right? <laughs> he kind of just uh, cocks an eyebrow looking at you like... Huh, yeah, uh, that's... <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, yeah, it's something in development, maybe... Who knows? She's gonna get like nod his head very awkwardly and very uncomfortably. <laughs> <laughs> hey Bernie. Um, can 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 you give us yeah. a second? Um for sure. Uh what I'll get I'll get your usual. Thank you, yeah. Yeah. And she uh walks off ahead of you. He's gonna kinda like gesture him into like a like a more like quiet place. <laughs> Are you good? You you're you're kind of stumbling over your words and stuff like. No, I it was very put off guard. I I guess I thought I made it more hidden that anything was happening. I didn't realize I made out with her in public. It put me off guard too that this was happening too. I heard about it this morning because you know I don't remember shit from last night. But uh, you made out in fr- apparently you made out in front of in front of Rinko. Uh. With her. Oh. Well, that wouldn't be a smart idea. No, that wouldn't be a smart idea. He's very like he's just like very much <laughs> glaring into the distance. 
Mm. Fucking insight yeah. check. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go for it. Oh boy. You try to hide anything here, Zane? Oh god, hardware uh, acceleration's off. There's nothing off. really to be hidden. He's just okay. very deeply looking oh, god. Um, off into space. <laughs> hardware oh. acceleration is not on for me right now. It's a, oh, it's a 13. Okay, well... Yeah, oh, no, I mean, 10, sorry, I'm sorry, 10. Yeah, okay, even with the 10, it's, I mean, he's he's not exactly being the most, you know, subtle, hidden, yeah, subtle person, yeah, subtle, thank you. It's just, I'm yeah. staring into space, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. well, you're not exactly sure what this could mean, I mean, for all you know, he also got fucking wasted, so. Right. So, what happened? What What, what do you remember? Well, I was with Sharina, came to the festival. I remember that she, she was the one I was supposed to take. Um, and then found you guys drinking maybe a little bit too much. You seem to actually be okay. Uh, everyone else, maybe not so much. Um, and then we just, yeah, got everyone home in, in groups. Mm -hmm. Wait, hold on. Do I know that? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Just making sure. I mean, it's pretty easy to figure out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I made sure uh, Rinko and Fave were okay, and they <laughs> seemed to be just laughing and, and giggling, having a great time. Hmm. <clears throat> uh, happy you and you and Bernie seem to be going quite well I had we're doing fantastic um nice are you sure everything's good just in general like uh, just everything going on are you good he's gonna look at him pretty seriously and just yeah yeah just figuring stuff out <laughs> As as we always are. Mm. Okay. Uh, speaking of that, though, I gotta I gotta <clears> run <throat> real quick. I I promised Cyrus I'd be back in a in a good time, so he, you know he'd have a a daycare to to watch after him. So okay, I just if anything happens, if anything goes on, please tell me. No, I, I right? appreciate you checking in. Yeah, just uh, just figuring stuff out. <laughs> But okay. uh, you don't want to keep the missus waiting too long. I will, uh, I'll see you around. All right. I'll see you at the, uh, the competition. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll just hand on his shoulder. Walk off his way. Yeah. Before mm -hmm. you leave, just hand on his shoulder. Just take care of yourself. I'll do my best. Mm. To you as well, though. Seems like a scary place out here. Too many, too many weird things going on. Oh, don't I know that? I mean, you heard what she did. <laughs> what she just said to you. Uh, yeah. she, she thinks she'll kick your ass, by the way. Oh, is that so? Both of you. Both of you and Cyrus. <laughs> well, at least I know I'll have competition. Did you hear, though? She she apparently, and again, don't tell anyone, but I'm going to hold this over his head. She threw my brother over her shoulder and, like, slammed him into the ground. While training, yeah. His eyes yeah. widened just a little bit. Um. You might be fucked. Oh. <laughs> you know, thanks for the confident boost. Maybe. You might be. You know what you could do? Maybe just say you want to stay in the night, you know? It's, oh, absolutely so not. Have you have my back broke. Oh, okay. Absolutely not. Both of you need to be pulled down a little bit. <laughs> you two are way too strong. Ah, uh, I see. The peg or two down. <laughs> it's fine. Okay. It'll be fine. You two yeah, are extremely that's... strong, you know, in that other place, but uh, over here, I mean, it'd be kind of a nice little humbling moment for you two. <laughs> uh, you really, Whoa, the disrespect. You really know how to moment. bring that confidence. Look, up, you know? look, oh the amount of times God. we've been over there and the amount of times I've lost consciousness, it kind of fucking sucks. I don't remember half of the things going on over there. <laughs> no, it, it'll be a confidence boost for myself, you know? Fair enough. <laughs> I do have faith well, that you two will go far. Yeah, but, no, it's, I of mean, course, I gotta, I gotta take great. her corner, you know. 
<laughs> as you would. <laughs> A little hurt, but as you would. Look, I've seen the shit you can do. I do think you can go far, but I mean... Yeah, yeah this isn't in the, 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 the fairy tale realm. This yeah. is this realm. Okay, you know what? Right now, try and pick me up. He's just going to hold his arms uh, out. Uh, okay. Make his trunk. He's going to he's gonna go to pick it. Oh, I have a strength you. Check. It's on. He, oh, he, he's sweet. heavy. He's a heavy guy. No. No. <laughs> you are you are trying no. to lift a 200 plus pound Leonin. <laughs> yeah. That did not work. <laughs> significantly, yeah, you, you know, he, a little significantly taller than you and very heavy. His toes will like leave, like, like it'll be like his toes touching the ground. You like lift him off of his ankles. Uh, maybe I haven't woken up fully today. <laughs> ah, maybe not. It's fine. Uh, this is a wonderful confident booster. Thank you. He's going to kind of <laughs> give the shoulder, uh, a shoulder tap. I'll see you around. <laughs> Yeah, he'll, uh, he'll, he'll... Every scent is on it's so funny right now. <laughs> <laughs> Look, festivities. He loves them. <laughs> Good God. Uh, anyways, uh, never mind. You know, never mind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, genuinely, I wish you luck. I, I, I think you'll be fine. I think it'll be fine. <laughs> I'm just giving you a hard time. Yeah, we sure damn hope. <laughs> uh, he walks away. <laughs> Yeah, he's in, I'm walking to my destination. Okay. Uh, my money's Where? on Barney. <laughs> <laughs> Quietly, you don't hear this. <laughs> yeah. Uh, um. So you, you can go off and uh, have your morning breakfast with yeah. Bernie. What are, what are you doing, Avra? Uh, well, after that humiliation, he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna want to go to the strength check for the strength of Willis Strong. Oh my God. And he's now gonna make sure his confidence isn't fully fucked. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Yeah. Test test the strength. All right, you make yeah. your way over there. Okay. Go oh, ahead, Jamie. I die. One more. Oh, yeah, please. That's a low roll. <laughs> uh, that was a wild roll. I genuinely expect you to just I easily have. just Actual scoop quick him up. For Avaraf, then. Uh, oh. Is your strength naturally just that high, or do you have an item that's giving you the plus five? What do you mean that high? No, it's naturally that well, high. Yeah. It's, it's naturally that high? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I, just, so I was just making five? sure because cause yeah. mine is. is that high oh just yeah of, no i don't have any cool have... belts or anything no yeah. yeah i was just curious i figured yours was just naturally that insane but you know yeah natural strength welcome as a rune knight <laughs> <laughs> all right yeah let's go let's go fix up some fucking... <laughs> yeah go ahead and roll that strength check all right are we over there this guy doesn't have any quips for me actually you know what You're i'm just there. gonna walk up to this guy and i'm just yeah. gonna grab the hammer from him yeah, he he does it before he even gets to say anything. You have the hammer in hand, and he just Perfect. nods and says, "Mm hmm." And takes a step back. I can't wait for this to fail. It did fail. Oh! It was on. <laughs> it was on a nineteen. Um, wow. I'm so glad I didn't tell him fucked. I passed that. You, <laughs> I was gonna. The pressure plate, and you almost feel like the hammer slipped out of your hands. When you went to go swing, he's gonna turn his head to him immediately. Be like, "Do you have a different hammer?" Scratches his face. <clears throat> you want some grips on those, huh? Eh, something. All right. He uh, walks around to the back of the test of strength. He walks back, has wrist wraps that he puts on you and wraps around the hammer. <laughs> Don't lose your grip, Sonny. And he pats oh. you on the back. Oh, Give that's a fucking go. sunny, bro. <laughs> what are these rolls, man? Hey, that's better. That's better. That's better. No. It's better. You have a little more oh grip, but this God. hammer is a little heavier than you were given uh, credit for. You, what you, I mean, you got a lot fuck? on your mind, man. You know, it's just not in the cards right now. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, my God. Can I take a potion? <laughs> it don't not, work, Not buddy. here. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> hey, man. Can I drink a protein <laughs> shake? <laughs> yeah. Third time's yeah. the charm, dude. G get it. Get oh it. My God. Do it. Do it, it. Took, it, it took literally Sadie Cyrus and Sent so three higher. times to do no, it. No, Sent was the second time. There's uh, uh, yeah, 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 Sent was like Sent got it in, in. Three three people stop and say, hey, isn't that the Squire for a uh, show? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, dude, you got it. You got to do it now. You got to do it another time. You can't walk away now. You're fucking... Everything is hinging on this. Everything is hinging on this. 
you give it another go. What is this? It keeps, <laughs> hold on. I need to take a. Hold on. Yeah, please change your dice. Change yeah, your change, dice. That's I'll wild. Take a picture or screenshot if, uh, if it's cocked. Yeah, if it's cocked or if it like, doesn't roll, then change your dice or something. It just smacked into a corner, man. <laughs> are, are you full yeah. screen with the, with the character sheet? What was that? Is your character sheet full screen? Or no? no? All right, full screen and roll it again. <laughs> Yeah, wait, that way it actually... have it in a wait, it actually affects yeah. it on the window? Yeah, it window? actually affects it affects, yeah. it affects the movement of the dice, yeah. Because mm -hmm. it rolls in the how however big the window is. And yeah. if you're only making it pretty really small, then Yeah. Yeah, try try maximizing it, go for it. Yeah. Let's see it. And... It'll give it more room to actually roll. <laughs> this feels like it should have been an eighteen. Alright. Oh. Man, come on. Hold on. Let me change my fucking dice again. <laughs> I don't have that many. Oh. Hold on. My, how do I get back to the campaign? God damn it. Uh, my characters. View. There Wait, you go. don't just have your character sheet like bookmarked? Well, it's an opera. Yeah. Okay, come on. Please. All right, all right, all right, all right. What the this fuck? Is like, oh, it's still all right. better. Ooh, it's 14, still 14. better. It goes up. It goes up about three quarters of the way, and the uh, the guy kind of claps and he says, "All right, third time's the charm." And uh, the people who are watching go, "Well, you know, is what it is." <laughs> three quarters is pretty high. That's still pretty good. And uh, the guy, the guy um, running the booth says. All right, well, not quite a win, but here you go. Uh, you can take a reindeer or a penguin plushie. It's going to blankly stare at him. <laughs> uh, you know, you can just keep them. He's going to kind of like just somber walk a little bit away. Uh -huh. uh, now, dashing. Mm -hmm. Is there any way to <laughs> RP the fuck out of this, or is it just a single? It is smack a test of strength. It is it, that. It is <laughs> take your hammer, hit a pressure plate. That is okay. it. You, you didn't add any like, flavor to it. You just like you went up there and you, you did. You know, say, like yeah. Could you? Uh, could you? Like, can I, like, dip a flair yeah. added fla flavor. Yes, and the yeah, other day I'm and it did not work. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> no. I mean, Cyrus and Scent did, and Cyrus just still spat in his hand and just bam, and Cy yeah. what, Scent took out his you pocket guys both band, right? Yeah, I literally, I, I, no, I, I put, I put uh, my hand in, uh, like, I have a, I have a, pocket like a, sand. I have some pocket sand or whatever, so I put my hand in there and, like, rubbed it together when the guy wasn't looking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Basically put chalk on Dude, my hand. Pocket sand? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've had oh pocket my sand. God. Yeah. yeah. Ultimately, it's we're just you know it's like the whole oh you didn't flavor it before you rolled that's why the dice gave you a shit yeah roll. and i rolled yeah, a natural 18 like because of it today. What <laughs> yeah. The fuck? yeah i'm gonna turn around to this guy and just be like <sighs> it's not rigged oh, yeah. and he puts his hands on the thing oh my god can i perception it <laughs> <laughs> yeah investigate it what i don't yeah, know what go I do. investigation, yeah okay Okay, that's high. That's crazy. Not rigged. <laughs> not rigged at all. Like, it's not, not rigged at all. <laughs> not rigged. Do we have to use your hammers? It's what if I just hammer. use my fist? No oh, hammer. Pure your... strength. Kind of scratches his head, scratches the inner ear, and he says, "It's not a speed bag." But you know this will be hilarious. Go for it. Yell him doing it. Right about that. He, he walks over and he takes a seat in a, in a chair nearby and he just uh, oh leans God. back and he says, "Give it a little punch." Can I equip my gauntlets? <laughs> yeah, you can take out a gauntlet for sure. Really? Okay, yeah, fuck yeah. yeah. Take it off this fucking wrap. Get this, get this off. Yeah. It's get not your, your super wrap. duper gauntlets, but it's just regular gauntlets. Mm -hmm. It's the arena. Wow, I don't know what gauntlets they are. Okay. Put my gauntlets on. Mm -hmm. uh, is it still just pure strength? Uh, Yep. yep. Oh boy. Still strength check. I can't wait for this to deal damage to Abra. 
I, it was on a 19. <gasps> no. Wait, was you have a screenshot? Was it was a clock? Oh, Window. Well, it's doing the thing that mine was doing. Window shift Dude, S for screenshots. Did you thing yesterday as well? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Window shift S to quick screenshot it. Unless it's already gone. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably already gone now, but it's going forward. No, I have. I have. I have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Throw it in campaign chat or something. Mm -hmm. Fucking, I don't know. You just, well, you just can paste it in, yeah. Mm. What is that? Oh, that is cocked as fuck. Mm. Oh, yeah. That is that's, so that's, cocked. That's, that's oh, so cocked. Oh, my God. Yeah, roll that yeah. again. That is so cocked. Yeah, definitely cocked. roll that again. That's that's, that's not, not a even, three. Not that's not a where, three at all. That should be a where five. Even, where anything. even is the three on that? Yeah. <laughs> <That's a five. laughs> oh. Yeah. What? Yeah, I'm okay. seeing that as a five, not a three. Yeah. That's wild. Okay. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> what? Well, there's the five. Oh, I'm taking another picture. I don't know. You be the judge, man. That's wild. It's in a corner. No, that's a five. That's, oh, that's sadly, that's sadly, that's a five. That's a five. five. Yeah. That's a five. <laughs> all right, bro. Yeah, sadly, <laughs> that one's a five. Yeah, yeah that's wild, yeah. though. What is, what is all these rolls? <laughs> hey, man, think about it like this. Get all the bad rolls out now before the tournament. True. Uh, right, I'm gonna. Cox I some switch while I fucking die, dude. Can he I buy die? Violin stands up. Yeah, yeah. There are dice you can buy. Yeah. I wanna. Yeah, buy you them. can buy more die. Yeah. It's like five bucks. I have an I'm eyeball. My dice is an <laughs> eyeball. Yeah, Vecna's Vecna die. Yeah. yeah. I I kept changing my dice every single roll, and it didn't matter. Uh. But actually, you you might want to get Vecna's dice because then it's like actually random. Yeah. Yeah, because it doesn't. It, dice. Yeah, it just it's dice. just an eyeball, so it's like pure random. It'll yeah. be pure yeah. RNG. Like, oh yeah. really? Instead of rolling? Yeah. So yeah. like. Yeah. How, well, it, the, it's an them? eyeball, so it'll just. Like you know, I didn't know that was a four, but it's it's literally just an eyeball that oh, rolls and then it the... flops up to the top and shows what the dice is. If yeah. you click on marketplace oh. name. Yeah. yeah. Um, believe. If you click on Beyond Digital. Mm -hmm. You can click on dice and then you can look at all the dice that are there. Yep. Sadly, not sponsored by D&D &D Beyond, guys, but, uh, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah, dice have been... Oh, I see. Six yeah. Blacksmith's dice pack looks nice. Yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, I have I have the Treasure Vecna holder. and Clockwork. Both the very cool. Palar or whatever looks pretty cool. Yeah. I have I have all of them. Of course you do. Oh! <laughs> Golden Bolt, my buddy. But yeah, they're cool. Like, there, there's a lot of cool ones. If you want one that's on theme for forever, I'd say Clash of Thorns is a is a pretty good one. True. Because that's Clashes, why I got yeah. the Dice of Enlightenment, because I was like, that's the closest thing I could probably find to being in theme with, like, Lathander and Cyrus. Okay. Yeah, I like to use the Clockwork ones for Dane. Mm -hmm. Oh, Golden Balls, why I have my bad. Um, all right, well. Yeah. What? Yeah, what the fuck? Uh... He's just gonna. I'll just, I'll just look at the guy and be like, <laughs> "Can I come tomorrow or something? Maybe today's just not it, man." You all can right. you can do this all day if you want. This is entertaining <laughs> as hell. Are you? Is you? I, he watched this and he stands up. He walks over. He takes his hammer, cracks his back, cracks his arms, cracks his hands, grips the hammer. Please him. Please he's tell me he rips, it very rips closely. back, fucking hits it, bing. <laughs> Puts the hammer down. Is that easy? <laughs> Memorizing okay. his form. He's gonna he's gonna kind of walk up to himself. <laughs> just, oh, okay. He's gonna he's gonna kind of follow his moves. Maybe not to the T. Mm -hmm. He's gonna crack his neck. Gotta stretch out his arms. <laughs> do his like do like a fucking like that like leg stretch thing and be like, you know, maybe like he'll yell Goku at me does. for using my legs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And he's gonna do is like some some like uh toe taps kind of jumping up and down mm -hmm. <sighs> okay warm up maybe i just had to wake up maybe <laughs> whoa my whoa. discord just my discord disconnected uh, that was weird yeah, it's just for just yeah, a moment yeah though. yeah oh you're good okay. smash is that your thing that was yeah, that was my entry, thing. yeah. oh okay yeah okay <laughs> so, yeah, but you're gonna smash that smash. pressure warm point up. he's gonna grip just like it you now just with smash both that hands <laughs> Mm -hmm. And just kind of whip it behind his head and even stretch his back a little bit into a bridge. 
and then just firm up and then let's all right come on ah. <laughs> ah, dude dashing is this revenge for like do you do you know the people at D &D beyond do you it's know me. people at D D beyond it's, it's this it's this flare from the grave i fucking <laughs> wish i knew wizards of the coast so i could do this oh, but no shit. i'm just gonna be gathering an audience of how my feeble my attempts are holy shit oh some people this were uh, walking by, saw your like epic wind up, and they were like, "Ooh, this is gonna be really good!" Oh my god, Can check this guy out. I'm not even halfway up. <laughs> Damn. Just... Ooh. <laughs> Man, the public opinion of Avraf is gonna sink. <laughs> it's dropping. And this is your like first thing in the morning too, bro. Well, there should be no one up right now. Everyone, I wanted to oh, come bullshit. here early. Oh, so no the fire be festival, here. man. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Oh. Nine, you just got eight, to 12, pick up 10, 14, 8, 10, 18, Dude, 11. How? Like, failure prince is. Yeah, is literally, oh after my the God. conversation I had with fucking Gage, and the oh. failure prince is ringing again. The failure oh, part is alive man. and well. <laughs> <laughs> it's working as the is just kind of like getting out of the shower by this point. Shit. He's like, huh, I've wrapped up back yet. And he's kind of like getting over his hangover a bit, and he's just gonna like shake off the. The hair, he can put the, the water from his hair a little bit and just be like, hmm, maybe I'll go out on my own if he doesn't come back soon. And Cyrus just <laughs> shrug, his, shrug his shoulders and go to like put on his clothes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you, sir. I don't know what's happening today. I thought I would be ready for this today and I don't seem like I am. <laughs> what What's wrong? Is it my form? Is it is it my hands? Am I like... <sighs> He gets up from his chair, he walks over and takes the hammer from you and pats you on the back. Sometimes you're just too weak, Sonny. And he <laughs> walks away. <laughs> well, step right <laughs> up, step right up, test the strength. <laughs> Blair on her way to Dane is just going to do a drive-by. <laughs> yeah, dude, imagine. Can she? Uh... May I? I just want just just for the just for the RP, just for the meme. I just want to see if I can roll higher than Zane Lee. <laughs> oh my god. No, nah, go yeah. ahead. Do the strength right now. I yeah, go see. go ahead and roll the strength check. Flair isn't there, but I just want to see. I just I want to see. Bro. Maybe strength checks are just cursed. I it's the one to... up the top, not the saving throw. Yeah, right? it's the yes. six numbers at the top. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Can I do my saving throw? No. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, <laughs> uh, so, 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 somewhere off in the fucking distance. <laughs> Ding! Yeah, literally. <laughs> Flair just, Flair just rings the bell with mind. No, 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 no. As, as you're walking away from this test of strength, Avarif, you yeah. hear ding! And you turn around and it's this really scrawny kid. <laughs> no! <laughs> humiliation! Don't do it to my boy! And he's like, oh. Mommy, I did it! <laughs> Good job, Timmy! <laughs> Utter Timmy. defeat. As his mouth is completely just open. Just spoiled my second character. <laughs> yeah, Timmy. Yeah, literally. I want the koi to be mommy. <laughs> Timmy the 12 year old, the transfer student. Timmy Turner from Fairly Odd Parents. Oh, what are you doing God. in here? Navarreth is, is staring us down and he is not over this, this new challenge that has arose to him. This is more important than anything has ever come across to him now. Yeah. Um, yeah, um, he's just gonna, he's gonna go back to the dorm now. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, before yeah. you get there, um, yeah. Cyrus, as you maybe muster up the courage to perhaps go out on your own, there is a knock at your door. Cyrus is gonna, like, kind of, like, jump back a little bit because he wasn't expecting it. Nothing too big, but just a little, mm -hmm. like, he's about to, like, hand about to reach the door handle and it's just, like, here's a knock. He's like, oh, weird. Cyrus is gonna just like crack open the door a little bit and just poke one eye out and be like, "Hello." You poke Hello. your eye out and you are met with the eyeball poking their eye back in towards you. Okay. Cyrus is gonna <laughs> be like, "Hi." Hello. 
Cyrus will step back and open up the door more, and I'll be like, kind of just gesture for her to come in. She's like, come on, get Fuck here. Stage no, doing. Oh, ah, oh. <laughs> Cyrus is gonna close the door very cool, like quietly behind her. Be like, all right, it's just being extra careful. Mm -hmm. You never and know. She, uh, she looks at you, kind of raises an eyebrow. Oh, is that why you just invite girls into your room? No. <laughs> Hi, Faye. What can I do for you this fine morning after we're hungover? Hi, Rusty. I'm very hungover and I have a headache. I'm so sorry. Welcome to the club. It's not my first time. It's the worst. I'm never drinking again. You know, I don't blame you. Uh, I'm never drinking against Rinko again. But I am glad that I won. So, you know. Did you win? I don't remember. I won against Rinko. Uh, not against Flair. Congratulations! I, I got second place. I will take that silver medal. So, I have Very cool. some bragging rights. And he'll kind of just kind of stiffen his posture a little bit. <laughs> so do you always come in second, or...? <laughs> Cyrus is then going to just immediately slouch. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Listen, I mean, coming second is not anything to shake their tail at. Sometimes it's even better to come second than first, you know? Can it exactly. Mm -hmm. As long as it's not in the martial arts tournament. No, oh, no, 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 no. Full honesty, uh, I'm not, I, I don't anticipate me winning the whole thing, but if I do, that'd be awesome. That would be actually really cool. I'd be kind of impressed. Yeah, I, I'd be impressed too, considering, uh, you know, a little little flimsy arms out <laughs> here in the normal world and just kind of like lift them up and kind of dangle them. Like, not like spaghetti noodles. Like, they're a little more toned, you know. She reaches like, out and tries to like squish your muscle. Can't really squish the muscle. She's too weak. But uh, giving the motions of it and be like, yeah, you really got some noodle arms there. I hey, know. I'm a hey. tough girl. Yeah, I, I know you are with your super galaxy punch, but mm -hmm. like I could still punch somebody and it would hurt. You know, I thought about joining the martial arts tournament m myself, but I don't think anybody could handle my strength. No, you're doing everybody a favor by by withholding. You know, can't mm -hmm. can't let uh, everybody know your hand right away. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, well, since you're here. Uh, I have somebody to leave with, and uh, would you mind accompanying me while I run a quick errand before heading to the festival? I suppose I could go with you. Yeah, I was originally waiting on uh, Avraf, but, uh, you know, I, I got done getting cleaned up a little bit earlier than I was expecting, so mm -hmm. I figured I would uh, try and sneak my way out but i you know it's always better to go with somebody considering uh you know recent events yes for lack of a better word mm -hmm. so uh well so yeah i don't think anybody else could help you like i could anyway so better uh, me than anybody else i mean yeah yeah because you know uh yeah i don't think words need to be exchanged there i can tell what you're thinking what am i thinking I'm a mind reader. Then tell me what I was thinking. You're hungry. Uh, no, not too terribly hungry, because uh, Avraf actually did something nice and made me eggs. Avi was thoughtful this morning? I know, right? He gave me orange juice, too. Wonder if he had too much to drink. I don't know. I barely remember anything after I puked at the end of the competition. It's not that Abby isn't thoughtful. It's just... Hmm. I guess you can maybe poke and prod him when we run into him. I was too, uh... Delir- not delirious. Uh, a little too hungover when I woke up. Alright, well, I guess I would go with you. If you really want me to. I like appreciate you smile. Faye. <laughs> uh first uh i want to make a stop by ionos's office i have uh 
I have a ticket to give her. Okay, well, let's go. Yes. And you go. And, and you get there. Cool. Question. Yes. Uh, do I see Gage as I'm leaving or no? Uh, as you're leaving, no. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. That, that's just pure player asking that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Uh, it can With my passive perception, do I, like, notice anything, you know, a little too un uneasy or anything like that? With your passive, no, you don't. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so just keep on going. Cyrus has his hood up, cool. full, full disclosure, too. Like, he ain't Excellent. walking nowhere with that with that hood down. Yeah, yeah. Phage just kind of matching your pace walking through the halls. But you make it to Ionis' office easy enough. Cool. Uh, Cyrus will do a light knock on the door, see if she isn't there. Come in. Cool. Cyrus will come on in and he'll, he'll gesture for Faye to come in too. She follows suit. And she's, uh, uh, Ionis is sitting at her desk and she uh, looks at you. Ah, Ty. Oh, oh, Faye too. Excellent. I was Hi. just looking for uh, you both. Oh, you were? What's, what's up? Well, not actively looking, just, you know, the standard. I need to start looking for you. It's been a few days, so. Yeah, I will, uh, I'll tell you about that in, uh, in a minute, but, uh, but what's up? Well, since you've been shirking your duties as my squire, um, I've done all of your paperwork, so. Sorry. I haven't really had time to enjoy the festivities yesterday, but I'm caught up now. <clears throat> I hope there is still vouchers left. I would hate to be paying. Although mother and father said that they um, were supposed to be buying me a voucher. Well, speaking of vouchers, and Cyrus will kind of like grab his pocket and be like, mm -hmm. I already bought you one. And he'll kind of oh. like sheepishly walk up to the, the desk and kind of just slide it on there. <laughs> So does that make up for the fact that I disappeared for a week? Maybe just a little. And she takes the voucher and puts it into a, a small purse behind her chair and uh, she turns and looks at you. A better way to make it up to me is to spend time with your big sister. Yeah, uh, that was also the plan. Um, well, uh, so since Faye is also here, Mm -hmm. uh, she's well I mean she's already aware of the situation so I don't feel yeah. like it's necessary to hide our relationship no it's it's not about that I, I trust Faye and you know uh, the reason why it's a good thing Faye's here because it can explain why I uh, disappeared for a week Faye kind of looks nice. over at you and just says you want me to break the news no I'll do it I'll, I'll do it uh so she kind of steps almost. back. <laughs> so, sis, uh, don't get out of your chair. But why, why do I feel like when people say, hey, don't do something, I'm about to very much react in a negative way? Yeah, because you're gonna. Um, so. I kind of died. Like, actually died. You just see your eyes start twitching. But, 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 because of Faye, I'm alive. Faye saved my life. Literally. Her gaze goes over to Faye, and Faye just nods. Her eyes roll back towards you. And who was it, dear brother? Uh, well, uh, I'm going to ask you a question. This is totally not rhetorical. Who do you think it was? <sighs> At that point, Cyrus's tone is going to shift immediately from being, like, very, like, you know, sheepish and kind of coy about it and just being, like, dead serious, like, eyebrows furrowed, looking straight at her. Well, <clears throat> if you'll excuse me, and she stands up from her chair and she opens up a drawer and just grabs this knife and says, I'll be back in a few hours. Cyrus is going to immediately <laughs> go around the table and grab her arm and then take the knife from her very gingerly and put it behind his back and be like you're not doing anything okay 
I am going to literally end his very existence. Well, um, I hope you know that there is a non-zero percent chance that I will be fighting him in the martial arts tournament. Not for nothing, Sai. I trust your strength. I really, really do. But if he just killed you, don't you think that maybe it's not the greatest situation to be fighting him one-on-one? -on -one? Cyrus is going to slowly turn his head to Faye. Weren't you the one who said it might not be a bad idea to sign up to see if I can't beat him? <laughs> <laughs> who was the one who warned you? Huh? Faye, uh, Faye smiles and says, you got this, Rissy. That doesn't sound like a very good vote of confidence. <laughs> Had you not egged me on, mentioned, I don't know, maybe changing his palace a little bit, uh, maybe I wouldn't have signed up. Hmm? Hmm? Well, it's too late to rescind that now. I mean, you know, well, I believe in you, so take Push that. Push comes well. to shove. I know exactly what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, if you're getting your ass beat, then yeah, absolutely. Cyrus is just gonna just his his face is gonna just go so like, <laughs> like What's that supposed to mean? What do you think I'm going to do? Get your ass I kick his ass. Well, no! I Cyrus You're is just gonna like not gonna kick his ass. Vion <laughs> he's gonna let go Vionis' arm and he's gonna keep the knife far away from her. Yeah. On his other hand. And be like, no, uh, if I'm on the back foot and I feel like he's going to do something stupid, I'm just going to stick my key in him and start a dark hour. That's what I was going to say. Sure you were. I'm a mind reader. Anyways, he's going to turn back to Iowa. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. <laughs> Anyways, sis, to make a long story short, they saved my life, and because of some magical means i was able to still take my exams and uh make leo none the wiser though he doesn't know that i'm alive he still thinks that i'm dead and he somehow has some powers in the real world that's how he killed me well i suppose if he doesn't know that you're alive again then we're sort of in the clear and I won't kill him just yet but I am going to be watching this martial arts tournament and if I even smell a hint that he's going to do anything untoward towards you then I will not hesitate to do something about it and in that instance I would be totally fine because uh I'm going under an alias so he won't know he's fighting me until he sees me mm -hmm. very good so and I'm going to Ooh, am I going to have some choice things to say to him? I'm <laughs> sure he's going to know that I know. That you but know. Anyways, that he knows. Exactly. You know. Hmm. Anyways, Cyrus is going to gingerly take the knife and put it back in the drawer. Mm -hmm. close. That's why I was gone for a week. And I made sure to <sighs> be safe and heal because he stabbed me quite literally in the back. Mm-hmm. Enough so that I died from it. Mm -hmm. So I'm better now. And again, thanks to Faye. Because, surprise, Faye also has some powers too. And that's why she saved me. Um, I was yeah. getting that vibe. I mean, yeah, considering she saved me and I'm talking mm -hmm. about powers and shit around her, that makes sense, you know? Just, context yeah. clues. Mm -hmm. But still, uh, she helped me train. A little bit too. Ah, so you spent quality time together, did you? It, <clears throat> it's not how you're thinking it is. I it's didn't say true. anything. Anyways, you want to come spend some time with us <laughs> at the Fire Festival so we're not alone? I would love to. Thanks. Okay, let's go. <laughs> and Cyrus is just going to start walking towards the door and he's going to put his hand on the handle. And just stand there. It's like, need to grab a sundress or something? No, I'm already dressed and ready to go. Cool. Say, I need to grab anything while we're here? I don't know, maybe, uh... I'm gonna maybe... strangle... Sorry. <laughs> what are you saying? 
<laughs> what? <laughs> what? What are you saying, Cyrus? It's like, you, you need to grab anything while we're here? Faye shakes her head no. Okay, let's go to the fire festival. There's okay. still things to do before the competition begins. Lots to do. So, too much to do, one might say. Mm -hmm. All right, and you can head off towards the fire festival. You do intercept Avarif on your way there. Cyrus will be like, he'll just kind of like raise his hand and be like, yo, Faye beat you to me. Uh, not a worry. That's all calculated, I think. I don't think it was calculated. Right, Faye? Okay. Right, well, Abby. Yeah, right. Calculated, calculated effort. And guy stopped by and said, you know, if I... Anyways, let's go. I don't have <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, let's just let's just this. go. Oh, Cyrus is oh, just going to... Uh, wait, Abraham. so she's with you, right? Not Faye, but I forget your... What's Ionos. Ionos, Ionos and Ionos. Faye are yeah. both with me. Fr yeah. Uh, Ionos, good to see you again. Yes, hello, Avrif. That's... Cyrus is going to walk up to Tyonos and whisper near. He knows. Oh. I, I trust him. Oh, hello, Avrif. I, I, I told her you're chill, today. basically. That's fine. Um, I'm just... He's just going to turn around and walk. <laughs> He's had enough today. <laughs> yeah. Cyrus is going to <laughs> look back at Faye and Ionos and he'll kind of speed walk and kind of put his hand on Avrav's shoulder and be like, I just told her so that way she wouldn't, you know, be all cold around no. you. No, that's fine. I, it was just, uh, today is going unexpectedly unexpected. So, yeah. You good, buddy? You said it as very big. <laughs> oh, I will be. And it's this vengeance in his eyes against this fucking inanimate <laughs> machine. <laughs> Cyrus is going to like look at his eyes and see like, you know, that, that sort of fire. Yeah, see, a, like, yeah, see a bell. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Cyrus is just going to be like, <sighs> save it for the tournament, buddy. And then he's going to just put his hand on his back and just kind of walk with him a little bit and kind of just try to slow him down so we don't lose Ionos effect. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good to see you uh, alive and not, you know. Well, actually, you're kind of recovered well for how much you drank. You know, I'm kind of surprised too. Uh, yeah. Cool. All right. So you head off into the festival. Shigo. She here? Bye. She here. She here. She here. You make your way to Dane's apartment. Congratulations. You're there. she walks in because she's got a key mm -hmm. <laughs> and you're with Rinko so oh cool Rinko came yeah. yeah all right um yeah she's just gonna walk in and sing out for him yeah and you do and um you hear a book being placed on the table and uh walking around the corner you see Danny's like ah oh, hey well um what's going on uh... well you'd be uh already at the festival actually it's uh pretty early Looking at his watch. Wanted to check in with you first. Um, I, uh, I'm, I'm sorry that you, you can't really come in and oh. enjoy the festivities, but uh, please. Quick question. Quick if answer. You a, if you had a choice between a unicorn, a koyabi, a reindeer, or a penguin, what's your favorite animal, and for no reason in particular? favorite yeah i mean koi bees are so weird looking like yeah in a good way yeah you like that about them they're very interesting um <laughs> the way they like twist them themselves it's very ooh, spooky <laughs> uh yeah reindeers and penguins mm -hmm. they're all nice i don't think i'd be upset with any of them i'm not a big unicorn fan though I'm not a unicorn fan. Why not? I don't know. Just oh. Horse with a horn. I don't know. Weird. I, I mean, sure. I... It's, just, I mean, it's really just a horse. I... Yeah, but magical, right? Like, you kind could get... Kind of boring. I mean... If you had unicorn. any wish, though, Dane... Any... You, like, like, any and wish. A yeah, and a unicorn could grant it. Ooh. <sighs> Unlimited maple syrup. Maple syrup? That's it? Probably. Okay. 
Here's I mean, like, Dent, you can I mean, just yeah. buy maple syrup. I make I just... maple syrup. You make it? Yeah. When did you start this vent? Do you just go into trees and tap on them? Sometimes. Well, I didn't know that. Where's... You've been giving me the store-bought maple syrup and you've been making your own... What? No! You've been using I... my maple syrup. I've been using the store-bought con containers. Oh. Okay. All right. At least you're not holding out on me. Uh... Exactly. So, uh, I, uh, I just, she goes to sit down at the table mm -hmm. after grabbing, like, a snack t mm -hmm. to munch on. Um, so I had this, um, really weird dream last night. Right. Um, you both might want to take a seat. Dane sits down. Rinko is like making a cup of coffee and she walks over and sits down. Kind of looks at you just puzzled. Um. So, um. I guess I had a pretty big night drinking. Uh. Well, a, a few of us did. Uh. Rinko is nodding. Rin, did you see how I. I. Got back? I don't even know how I got back, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah. So apparently, I'd walked into the master's room and woke him up while I was drunk, and then I was sleep talking. Scandalous. And she takes a sip of her coffee. You didn't do anything to him, did you? I. Fuck, I hope not. <laughs> I, no, that, like, no, I, I mean, I would have been to, if anything, I'm sure that, you know, I'm in enough pain. He's a, he's I, a real gentleman. He wouldn't do that. No, of, of course not. I, I just, I'm pretty sure that I, I just must have fallen over or something. Mm. Um, but I, I. Right into his bed. No, <laughs> Ren. <laughs> I know, you're not me. I'm just making you fluster. You would... with the master? No. You wouldn't with... What? Okay. No. No. Have you? Why you... No. You sound weird. No. Have you thought about it? Definitely not. Okay. If you say so. She like, takes a hurried sip of her coffee. Insight check. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Yay! I remembered. <laughs> I can do D. I was wait. Things. I was waiting for it. I was waiting for it. Woohoo! Damn it! <laughs> Damn all the low rolls, dude. Yeesh. Uh, yeah. yeah, she seems like she's hard to read, but she's definitely a little panicky about the subject. <laughs> um, Flair's Flair's just smirking at her. Mm -hmm. It's like, spill it. What's your fantasy of you and the master? Is he sweeping you off your feet? Is he buying you flowers? Or is it... Fantasy of being the master? Look. Yeah? Come on, a little louder. Not it's under not... your breath, I... Rin. <laughs> Do not yeah. have a fantasy of me and the master doing anything. This isn't about me. Okay, all right. Why are we talking about my love life? Non-existent one. Uh, well... I mean, I, I guess it's actually just a funnier topic than what I was going to talk about, to be honest. <sighs> Is that why you're torturing me with this? Probably. Sorry, Ren. You're in the line of fire. Alright, well... <sighs> Alright. So... So anyway, while I was out and sleep talking all about it, I guess, I had kind of a weird dream. Um, and she's going to look at Dane. Uh, father was there. Kind of raises an eyebrow. All right. And he pulled me out of a river. And she's gonna like look at her hands and start fidgeting. 
and he said that it wasn't my time yet. Which, uh, I don't know about you guys, but of all the books I've read, that's usually something someone says to someone who's died. That's it, what it sounds like, Flair. Isn't it usually, like, you can't see yourself, you don't die in dreams, because otherwise you wake up? But, like, can you already be dead in a dream? Does that make sense? Were you thinking about father a lot? I mean, it's possible that, you know, you created a scenario in your dream where perhaps you were crossing over and seeing him. I suppose, but he told me some things that I, I don't feel like I would no, you know. He said... He said, uh... Well, of course, um, she reaches across the table and grabs Dane's hand. Mm -hmm. Of course, he... He says he hopes that you're okay. And... Um... And, uh... He was asking if our mother's alright, and... What, you think that Garant did something to him? Or That's her? what I was wondering. Because he asked, he asked if if something happened with our aunt. So I, I'm assuming that he knows. And he also said that he wants us to be careful of people from Azatar and and our auntie. So. Then, like, taken aback when you say Azatar. Would you know anything about about that? I mean, I, what, as, as a time, and, uh, father, as a yeah, and Ophelia? An order, Dane. Ha, huh. yeah. It Claire, was there an order? Huh? Sorry, I'm tired. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh. Been feeling a little under the weather the last few days, so. Yeah. Hmm. That's okay. You, uh, you rest as much as possible, but, um, another, uh, another th thing that he mentioned was Cain, and that there's a possibility, or he was under the impression that Cain isn't dead, and she's, like, really focused on his reaction. Kind of like raises an eyebrow. Didn't. Didn't he die at the house? Father seems to think if he was dead, he would know about it. And he would have been there in my dream or whatever. Well, I mean. Cain definitely is not alive, fight. I mean, I don't, I don't know, I... I didn't see the body, but... The way your mom reacted, there's no other way. Mm. Well, that's what I thought, but... Is there any other reason at all that you might know for certain that he died? Visited his grave once. 
Mm-hmm. I see. And she's going to sit back and take a deep breath. Um. Okay. Um. Can I can I insight check his reactions? Go for it. Can I do. Okay. Yeah. That's better. Seems confused. Raph strength checks. I. I. All right. Jeez. Uh. Yeah. It seems like he just seems confused about it. Mm hmm. Okay. All right. Um. Well. Uh. Dane, I think. Um. I think uh, if you give me a, you know, an idea of something that you'd want as like a, as a treat from, from the festival, I can bring it to you if you if you'd like. I'm really craving like fried foods. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, Ren and I will bring you home some fried foods later. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> and uh, will you be? I guess. Yeah. I mean. Or a penguin or a reindeer, for sure. Or a penguin or a reindeer. Right. I did, uh, I'd want a reindeer. I huh. Gave it to, to Wee Fee, though. But. Perfectly fine. Um, uh, Koyubi can, can be arranged. Because I think, uh, I think I got what it takes to get that one today. <clears throat> Alright, well. She's the best of luck to you. Um. Thanks. Uh. Do you want to? Uh. No, you know what? Actually, you just you you just sit tight and uh, take care of yourself and uh, make uh, maybe some maple bacon for dinner. Okay. You got me craving it now. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Okay. Try not to get too drunk tonight. Oh, don't you worry about me. I'm uh, I'm never drinking ever again. And right. um, she's gonna um, also. Hmm? Is there a reason for the change? What change? Looks over at Rinko, looks back to you. Season. It. Did it? And she like pulls her hair forward and sees that it's all white. Oh, when? Uh, okay, weird. And then she's gonna go to the bathroom mirror and mm -hmm. there, her eyes are now um, very pale blue. And uh, she's just going to admire them for a bit. She and um, and walk back out, and she's gonna be like, uh, I honestly hadn't realized. I just, I don't think I've ever been in winter before. Well, uh, I mean, Kane made it work for him, so. Yeah. This is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Wish I could ask him how to feel about it. <laughs> <laughs> I um do you think it it's should I be worried? Am I No, you're fine. Am I gonna get depression? Am I gonna be a, <laughs> a shut in? <laughs> I'm kidding, Flair. Go have fun at the festival. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Come on, Rin. And um, she's going to she gesture to Rin and... Stands up, chugs the rest of the coffee, puts it down. Later, Dane. And um, as they're walking, Flair's going to uh, start talking to Rinko. Mm-hmm. Um gonna be like i think i think we need to talk to the master about uh about these things i want to get 
get down to this, I think that, you know, this vision or whatever that I had is key to understanding what is happening with Dean. And the master seems like he's being coy about it with me, but I, I want answers, Rin. She nods and she says, well, we always have time after the festival um, before we go on break. Yeah. Take some time. Think about what you want to say, you know? Yeah. And she stops and kind of grabs hold of Rinko's hand. And she, like, looks in her eyes uh, very seriously. Do you think... Do you think there's any possibility that if Dane was the one to have... You know... Taken action against so many people, maybe he was the one who... Killed Cain? Did something to him? Is... Rinko looks a little confused and just says, I think, you know, maybe overthinking it. Um, you don't think it's... It might be possible. I don't know. Mm. Until we until we, talk, until we talk... Until we talk to the Master, and I mean... I, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. I... Uh, Let's go to that strength thing. I want to... <laughs> Christ. I want to be a four-time champ. All right. So you <laughs> make your way to the fire Festival. All of you, congratulations. You make it there roughly at the same time. Um... <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> uh, Flair and Rinko, you make it there and you see... Um... Cyrus, uh, Avrif, Faye, and Ionos. Um, as they are also entering the festival. She's going to nod gently towards Faye, but she's doing mm -hmm. anything to avoid eye contact with Avrif. <laughs> Faye, uh, so uh, we all see something? Uh, yeah, you all, you all eye contact with each other. As you're approaching the uh, festival grounds, and yeah, as Anth is, you... is starstruck as he has seen Flair. And as you, as you approach her, I'm, oh, I wrote this down somewhere. I know I did. <laughs> I wrote. Uh oh. I wrote it down in our DMs. Okay. Oh. That's where I put it. Anyway, oh, in our DMs. Um. Yeah, 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 I did. It's all right. I find it. Also, why, but, are you, why are you searching for that? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not going to search. <laughs> okay, cool. Never mind. Um, as, as you approach her, you see that her hair is no longer red. It no longer has white streaks. It's pure snow white and straight. There's no more, like, curls to it. It's sleek, straight, and her her eyes are like a shimmering icy blue like grey blue like piercing blue as Cyrus to, noticing oh sorry I'll let you finish yeah, yeah. as opposed to yeah that's it that's it as opposed to what it used to be cool uh, upon realizing that Cyrus is immediately going to like walk over not like sprint or speed walk but he's gonna walk towards Flair because he knows what he means when something changes color his cape being evidence of that uh, and he's immediately gonna be like, "What happened? What do you mean? Your your hair, your your eyes." Oh, uh, I'm an Aladdin nail. Is, is that just is that just it? it nothing, nothing else. <laughs> it's just. Rico sort of steps in front of Flair and just says, Yes, Rossi, sometimes Ladrons just change season. Cyrus is going to let a little sigh and he'll kind of relent a little bit. Sorry, just, just got concerned. Oh, uh, it's okay. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, well, also good hey. morning. Oh, yes, good morning. Uh, 
How's your hangover? Uh, probably not as bad as yours. Yeah. Anyone else get, like, a pain radiating from the back of their neck? It's just... <laughs> <laughs> Bro! Supposed to come? Bro! <laughs> Bro! Was it something in the alcohol? Or... <laughs> Cyrus is gonna like <laughs> cock one eye and an eye raise an eyebrow and be like, um, it's usually your stomach because that's where your liver is. Maybe you just slept on your neck wrong. You don't have, you don't have like a headache too. I mean, on? headaches, yeah, but not like specifically the back of my neck. It's more like towards the front. Just mm. like just rubbing it. She's like, uh. that's. <laughs> Cyrus is immediately gonna look to Rinko and be like, uh, <laughs> shrugs your shoulders. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, if that continues, um, martial arts tournament bracket is up. Martial arts tournament brackets. Glad did I, I didn't sign up for that. I hate to be doing that with a hangover. And then she just <laughs> gives Cyrus a hard pat on the back. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> Dad, you know, it's not as bad as, as it sounds. Anyways, Mr. Fister, let's go yes. check out the brackets. Okay. I was kind of See what we got going of, on. Like, look away when he walks over. <laughs> All right. Um, while the this tournament is starts in the afternoon, right? It does. Okay, cool. Just making sure because it's like, what would you say, eleven now? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the tournament starts around like one in the afternoon. Okay, cool. And yeah. Cool. Just trying to get my timeline of events all, mm -hmm. all put together. Yeah, you still have some time. <laughs> some time. Okay, there. It dun, is. dun dun dun. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, yeah, so while this is happening, uh, sent you and Bernie also hear that the brackets are posted, um, and you can also meander your way over there to see the tournament bracket. Yeah, he's gonna chug his coffee, grab Bernie by the hand, and walk on over. Mm -hmm. And you see the rest of your party entourage as Dave. they are also at the brackets. Yeah, he'll give like an, a like a bit of a, like a just a just an excited wave to everybody and make his way over. Mm -hmm. So I also kind of, you know, less enthusiastically, but still kind of like smile on his face, like raise his hand back up to, to send. Yeah, and Flair's he'll got see like Bernie. The same energy. <laughs> yeah, he'll see Bernie and he'll kind of be like, he'll he'll like do a very loud, audible, hoping that he doesn't, <laughs> knowing, how, knowing the horror stories, is like, I hope that I don't have to fight her. Mm -hmm. I hope I don't. He's just gonna All see. Right. Yeah, I'll just see the anxiety on on Cyrus's face and just crack a grin. <laughs> Cyrus will just kind of like get a little wry laugh and be like, <laughs> just turn around. And you can all take a look at the yeah. bracket and see where you fall. Or I guess Avrif and Cyrus can see where they fall. Let me get this open. Ooh, Leo and Bernice. Ooh. Oh, dang. Wow. Okay, someone's oh, wow. name is King, and that's terrifying. <laughs> Let me get this up for people. Shame is so furry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> ben Von Bleed. I I'm just I cannot get pa past Leonardo da Vinci. <laughs> <laughs> That's really funny. Dang. Okay. So okay. So damn. I'd have to get really fucking far in order to uh, get to the finals to fight. I thought I thought you would also laugh at uh, psilocybin. Where? Who is that? Where? Where? <laughs> oh right. Facing uh, Leonardo da Vinci. <laughs> psilocybin. <Right. laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I see, uh. <gasps> Adora! Mr. Fister. Irony? Giorno <laughs> Kresnik. See, Miss Sulfur? Yeah, I see that now. Wow. Lots of Fisters. A lot of Fisters. A lot of Fisters. Oh. 
Frost Fallside. That's a cool ass name. The true meaning of martial arts. <laughs> Harry with a rapier. I wonder what they're gonna do. Mm. Is SNS Sword and Shield? Is that what that sword is? Yeah. Shield, yeah. Yeah, Sword and Shield. Fulmer Sherman. I got it <laughs> up for everybody to see. Hell yeah. Very cool. Virginia Zane. <laughs> Zane. <Wait. laughs> oh, uh. <laughs> Virgin Zane! Virgin Zane! He didn't... I mean, oh, I don't ever paint a virgin that, anymore, man. but... Oh, what the fuck? I didn't but even Zane see is. that clip in there. Oh. Why, why you gotta Zane. call him out? Oh. That guy better win, bro. Avarif may not be a virgin, but oh. Zane is. Oh. Can't believe saying can't believe you're a virgin oh, so and a horse. Actual question then for clarification on these brackets: uh -huh. Are these two v twos? Uh, no, it is a, a one on one, okay. and then it's uh. Cool. I I, I yeah. wanted to I the way they they were linked up, I got a little confused. I think at one point, but no, that makes sense. Yeah. One v one. I forgot. Yeah. Cool. 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 Yeah. Please tell me that Sale's gonna yell out his own name when he like hits somebody. No, it's it's Sasalele, actually. Sasalele? Yeah, it's like sail, sail, but it's Sasalele, you know, like the, the sign. When it's like sail, but it's like on w the sail, sail is across two window panes, and they could only afford to put sail on one window pane with S A and L E underneath it, and on the next so window pane, it's the same thing. Sail is in like the, the boat. So it's sail, sail, not Salele, unfortunately. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Sasa eel eel. My my Sa jokes. Gonna... Anyways, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> ben Ben Von uh, Okay, I guess. Quick question then for. Oh, oh never, shit. Mind, never mind, never mind, <laughs> I just noticed. I just noticed something. <laughs> what? What? I'll hover over it for for for, for, for the viewers, it's... but uh, that's oh, gonna be so fun. Much. Ooh. That's gonna be fun. Ooh. What? Where? Where? Bonso Taric? That sounds like fucking like a Final Fantasy X reference with the Ronso, but it's Bonso, <laughs> and he's a spear wielder. Helga Hunter. Right, that know. that dashing. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, 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 I saw yeah. that. I was like, yeah. oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, it's okay. the it's the funny part because uh, that first round match and then the potential second round match is even more. <gasps> oh boy. Oh, in that same bracket. In that same bracket. Yeah. 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 Imagine if like Zane goes to roll for these and he just gets out immediately because Dude. Oh my god. <laughs> I think Fister I call it, I call it for a night, honestly, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I can like, do it. Sorry. Like I'm quitting the session. I'm I'm done. Catch me uh not next week but the Catch following me week. Never. Well, oh, the only way Cyrus and Leo will go against each other is in the finals. He's in the finals. Yeah. But Mr. Fister well, I could also face Cyrus. Actually, yeah, no, finals. Mr. Fister. Yeah, Mr. Fister would be in the finals. In the semifinals. Semifinals, yeah, sorry. Yeah. yeah. You gotta unnerf those dice first, buddy. I don't know what. Did I'm you buy do. that new pair of die? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Damn. All right, well. The reason I said damn, that when damn, Cyrus was talking is because I fucking rolled to dashing. And... There. <laughs> yeah. Because I don't think you guys saw that. Uh... <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I saw right. that. Oh, okay. Oh, I so saw that. I mean, yeah. that, I think that was the first thing that uh. Zeph, you, you saw that, oh. but did you see the potential second round matchup for Leo or Bernice? Below it. I didn't click. All right, let me zoom in and find them one more again. Mm. Yep. There is a character there. Yep. Oh. Yep. <laughs> Yeah. Mm. I, why are we secrets? <laughs> it's not secrets. It's right there. It's not a secret. <laughs> it's it's right there. Yeah. Who? 
No, it's Noah Aster. Yeah. Who? That's uh Ionos's aide. Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm. What? Mm. What's why wait? Why is this why is it's, it because it's Leo versus Noah, potentially, if he beats Bernie. Yeah. Is, is Noah a good guy? Yes. Or... Yeah, he's yes. Just, oh, okay. No, yeah. It's knowing how Leo hates Pontifex. Yes. Anything right, anything okay. relating Noah to the Pontifex. With, yeah, Noah is like one of the official mm. guard of the church. Yep. Ooh, okay, okay. Ooh, yeah, he, he's, wow, he's, he's, spooky, ooh. Yeah, he's, he's known like Cyrus <laughs> and I know since they were kids. Yes. Fucking boy. All right, guess uh, I guess we're gonna be paying close attention to these brackets. And round one and two. You're gonna have to fight Athos at some point, though, Cyrus. Yeah, potentially if he loses, though. Okay. I'm saying it's a possibility, you know. It's always a possibility. Round one, two, and three are today, and then yep. rounds uh, the semifinal. Or I'm sorry, uh, rounds one, two, three, and four, I believe, are today, and then semifinals and finals are tomorrow. I believe gotcha. Cyrus is going to have to fight Virgin Zay. <laughs> oh my god! All those years of no feps made it too strong. He's a spirit, he's a spirit user, though. Okay. <laughs> He's the chosen. <laughs> Back in the world of RP, oh Sarah is going God. to he's going to kind of like heave like a little bit of a sigh of relief, knowing that he's not fighting Leo right away. Mm -hmm. You know, look to Davern and be like, huh, "Guess we won't be fighting against each other unless we make it to the finals, huh?" Guess there's only one way to do it then. He's gonna stick out his hand. Let's both get there. Saras will give a very solemn nod, very strong, and he'll, you know, grab him, grab Avarev's hand by like the wrist and hold it tight. Yeah, uh, yeah, Sent will see, uh, who Bernie's going against and kind of grip her hand and also, like, with his opposite hand, kind of like grip himself, like grip the oh, same Bernice arm. Is Bernie. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 His, his grip will like tighten on Bernie's hand and like the same hand will like tighten on his own arm. All right. All right. What just happened? Discord's broke, man. Discord's Discord. broke. Discord being Discord right now. Dude oh literally is just like, he's going to grip his hand and then just <laughs> let me in. I'm trying to fuck. <laughs> No, so no. I thought he was gonna. <laughs> no, so he's. I'm glad the recording at least caught what you were that saying. Oh, yeah, great. yeah, that it was is. Fucking yeah, great. yeah, yeah. So he's like, his hand's gonna like grip tightly on Bernie's hand, and then his opposite mm -hmm. hand's gonna like grip on his own arm, like digging his claws into him to like yeah. prevent himself from digging his claws into her hand. Just like his, he he went kind of pale. As Cyrus is kind of finishing up. Uh, you know, shaking Avrev's hand, he'll kind of look behind to see Scent, and it's pretty visibly obvious, like, how Scent's feeling, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. His, 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 the colors left his face. Cool. And then Cyrus, uh, noticing that, he'll turn back to look and kind of more thoroughly look over the, the, whatchamacallit, uh, the, the matchups. Mm -hmm. And then he'll, he'll stumble along Lino versus Bernice, and his eyes will widen and be like, why, why are we shooting? I want you to know how hard I, I had to fight. Why are we shitting? The last. I want you to know how invested I am in this and how hard I'm fighting. I'm not laughing right now, okay? Uh, Cyrus ooh. is going to turn over and be like, we're shitting because of Lino. God damn it. Lino! My RP. Lino. Fuck out of my RP. Lino! Sorry. Mm. We're shitting. As Leo is up against Bernice in the first round. Bernie. He's gonna glance at Bernie and just. She looks confident. Yeah. Do you, uh. You got anything to power him? I have my fists. Oh, he's gonna fit up his fists as well. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Cyrus is gonna uh... 
grab Avarath and kind of lead him in and get close to his ear and whisper, hmm. it's not because I don't have faith in Bernie. It's because it's Leo, you know, guy who has powers oh, out here. It's definitely me. on something for sure. Yeah. It's not going to be a fair fight as much as I want Bernie to win. Cyrus is going to... You might not show them. Way to go, them. Bernie! Might not show them. <laughs> Cyrus is going to look this at and will kind of gesture his head to step away for a sec. Yeah, he'll like do like a, like, like kind of grip her hand twice and just kind of like, oh. Yeah. Just, just be like, one sec. I'm walk over. going to glaze yeah. over at Flair. <laughs> Cyrus Bernie just gonna... gets closer to the bracket and is like, yeah, I see the path. You'll kick yeah, Noah's ass good. after after beating up Leo. You'll be fine. He's walking away. She ain't looking. She, oh, no. Flair, Flair meets Avra's gaze and then look like she she just kind of shudders a bit and then looks away. <laughs> She's like, ugh. <laughs> He'll like, like, hand, like, hand, like, kind of on, on, like, Flair's back and kind of, like, kind of coax her over if she, if she follows. Yeah. She'll, she'll come. Hmm. Oh. Cool. And we're <laughs> Cyrus is walking like about like maybe like you know ten feet away from the group a little bit, and as he's walking mm -hmm. by Onos, he'll just kind of look at her very sternly and just kind of shake his head a little bit, not like in a disapproving way, or just kind of like just you know very small nods. She kind of looks at you and then she walks over to Bernie and says, "So you're facing Noah in the second round," and she just kind of like distracts Bernie. <laughs> hmm. Once we're about 10 feet away, Cyrus will look to Scent and be like, so what do we want to do? Hmm. I don't... I know Bernie's strong, but I don't... I don't trust her going against Leo. I think it's more she... so I don't trust Leo as opposed to not trusting Bernie. I think she'll be okay, but... Uh, I'm more concerned about... the. Uh, whether he'll, if he has any powers outside of the palace or not, if he'll show them. Zen has no idea, by the way. Like, he, like you haven't told him. Shit. So, just making that aware. Mm. Um, he... Cyrus will take a deep breath in and he'll just do one big inhale and he'll be like, he won't show his hand in front of so many people, but that's how he got me. Mm. I don't know what extent he does in terms of how strong he is. But he can at least make illusions of himself. But I sincerely doubt he's going to do anything like that and out himself in the arena. But as <laughs> for any sort of boost, like how we get when we're in palaces in the other world. Right, you're stronger in there, so. I just don't know. Yeah. Question to DM for my my history with Leo. Uh, mm -hmm. Roughly, how strong would I think Leo to be? Like, just about like, like not overwhelmingly strong. Like outside of palaces, he's like, just, got like, from, from like our history growing up together. He is deceiving strength. Like he doesn't look strength. like he'd be strong, but he's pretty strong. Pretty okay, deceiving. Cool, cool. Gotcha. Like he doesn't really show. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't show his hand, which is yeah. kind of cool. All right, sorry. Uh, sorry to say. Leo's already kind of a, kind of a tough guy. He just doesn't show it, but if he's extra strong, I don't know. Hmm. I just need to keep a very close eye. And if uh maybe if something happens and she gets badly hurt, I'll spontaneously run out and uh call the fight off. And if he continues, then, uh, put my key in. Maybe that'll be the way. Cyrus will kind of just, uh, stare. Not blankly, but just kind of stare forward. Kind of looking past scent. Just kind of staring into space, contemplating. Ever at this point is actually going to start walking off uh, away from everyone. Okay. 
You okay? Towards, uh, let's say, let's say, wherever the dark throwing is. <laughs> 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 the tent of many games. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's the tent of many games. Yeah. Yeah, he'll kind of see you like wander off and just ask if you're, you're okay. Are you guys still in your huddle or no? Yes. We're yeah. not really in a huddle. We're just like, you know, it's the three of us kind of talking. Yeah, yeah. I already heard trying to walk to where Flair was, and then Flair walked to you guys. So I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna keep walking to the mini games. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh sorry, wait, Aver wait, Averif was walking to Flair. Yes. Oh, and then just sent lit her and away. And then sent let her away. Yeah, that's why he was. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Yes, okay. yes, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Sent, 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 sent let her like with yeah, them. Oh, it was, no, no. Yeah, a lot yeah. of what's happening all at once is like Cyrus kind of yeah. took the lead to like step out 10 feet away and then, uh, as, you know, he like nods Dionos and then like, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. said his thing to you and then as Scent was going, like he kind of yeah. just, you know, coaxed his hand on Flair's yeah. back to coax her along if she wanted to come. Yeah. And she did. So. Yeah. Uh, okay. And that's when you had your reaction, all that. So uh, yep. Zane's kind of like right of being like, I'm doing this. Yeah. yeah. Because yep. this has failed. Yeah. 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 Okay. I meant to be walking this way. <laughs> yes. Um, Cyrus is going to look this in and be like, what if... What if we find a way to swap our brackets? <sighs> for Bernie. And I know what you're going to say. It sounds like a dumbass move. And you're it right. does. It is. But I'd rather not see Bernie get hurt. Oh, sorry. This conversation's happening in front of Flair. Yes, you're with us. With, you're, you're there. With us. Okay. You're there. All right. Yeah, pulled pull, 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 yeah, pull you in. Pulled you in. Oh, yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, 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 the, like, the, like, the, like, the, like the, yeah. like the gesture that Sent did was kind of like to kind of, kind of coax you with us, into, mm -hmm. like, into the conversation, like away from everybody. Yeah. Yeah. It was just whether you were gonna follow or not. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So Flair, it's okay to have. Yeah, Flair, Flair, is, Flair is involved. You're Flair there. is involved. Yeah, you're yes. there. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. You are cool, good. Cool, cool, cool. You are good. Yeah, you're there. You're present for everything that you know we've we've briefly talked about. Yes. Okay. Cool. Bananas. Um. Yeah. Avrov's the only one who's not because he walked away. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And and wrinkles and and Bernie the rest of them are, are all present. off. By, yeah. By Bernie. They're okay. they're just by Bernie. Just yeah. Tracking, right? Wait. Yeah. Wrinkles here too. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Bernie yes. Ionos and oh, Rinko are over at the bracket. And Faye. And Faye. Yes. Yes, all, all of our individual all the pussies are. Everyone but Dane. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. he's, he's going to kind of look at Cyrus and just go, uh, so, uh, can't Faye use powders outside of all of this? She can. Has anyone asked how she can? Oh, uh. Wait. Oh. None of us. No one. I'll be right back. Because He's gonna go grab Faye. <laughs> ah, Faye, I need, I need you real quick. Hello. I need you real quick. Come okay. Here. Um. Sure. Hi. Welcome to Book Club, Faye. Uh, tell us how ah. you can use your powers outside of the palaces. Wow. What a nice book. Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm concerned about the Leo Bernie bracket, and uh, I want to know how you're able to use your powers. If there's a possibility that we can tap into that ourselves. Years of training. Is it really? Well, we're fucked. <laughs> is is it actually? Oh. Well, I mean, a little bit, yeah. Okay. You need to be, you know, fully in tune with your persona. Hmm. So is that also suggesting that Leo is fully in tune with his persona? Potentially. Or are there or other he... ways? Um, I mean, magical items exist. I mean, Rusty, you were able to use one. The uh, stone visual the ring, distortion. The ring, the ring, the ring. Yeah. Yes, that's yes, cool. Would there be a way for Bernice to use that? And he points at your belt, Cyrus. Cyrus is gonna look down. And be like, <sighs> Does nothing for me. Probably I not. I it would take a while to to make it so it'll work, and I wouldn't have it ready by this afternoon. Hmm. Even even Big Brother wouldn't be able to do it. Damn. Uh, 
And he's pretty good at making magic items work out here. Could he maybe be present to make sure that nothing bad happens to her? I mean, I could ask. Or is it possible that somehow you could swap Bernie's placement in the bracket with somebody else? Maybe me? You want me to go back in time and change that? Wait, you can... Wait, what? I'm Wait. not supposed to interfere with history too much. Question then. Yes. Um, could you maybe go back with one of us for, I don't know, a certain amount of time and maybe help us? Well, I've already taken know. Abby to the past once already. You have? Did... No. Abby! He's gone. He's long gone, and at this point, just, I'm not surprised. See Avarith uh, still walking away, and she's just like, Avarith Zested. <laughs> get. He's, pout he's poutfully walking away. Back <laughs> over here. Ooh. Can you make a mad dash? Away? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, to her? Yeah. Can you get yeah, like a yeah. sprint formation and just like see what she does? Uh, yeah, go for it. All right, I'm just um, gonna go down and like get ready to like sprint, kind of like a scared cat, like just. Whoo. Are you, are you coming over here? Or are you running away? What are you doing? What do you want from me? Get over here! Get over here! Uh. No, my his eyes are darting around. <laughs> You're not uh, in trouble. I why well, he's gonna kind of glare at Flair or not glare, but like look at Flair. Uh, I don't. I don't think so right now. I'm gonna go to the bath. Abby, she's I'm gonna, gonna the like bathroom squint is calling at calling me. Avarith. Uh, hi, hi. Jay needs you, and you need to answer questions. We're all well, we're all friends here. Let's just clearing some dead air. Like just clearing some things up. That's all it is. Just kind of like very take some long steps over there. Just kind of. <laughs> <sighs> Pulls, pull, she pulls uh, Avarif into the huddle. Avarif. Yeah. You didn't tell them that I took you to the past. Uh, no. Why? Why did you tell them? Because, because... I thought that they already knew. Because I thought oh. you just told them. Well, and Flair knows. The other reason why is because we're trying to figure out ways we can help Bernie. Uh. And Faye just mess? casually mentioned it. Do you want to mess with time just to save a bracket? It's it's not the matter of messing with time. It's a matter of messing with maybe the bracket placement. I'll get in why trouble. Why don't we just go? Why don't no. we just bribe them? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not considering messing with the bracket. I'm thinking like this is gonna sound really weird, but what if I went back with you a few years? Okay. Okay. And you trained me how to use my persona. What? You mean spend a few years training? Yeah. And then just came back here at this point. Unless someone else wants to do this. I mean, I'm offering to take Bernie's place. This is more a I I have just to be I, clear, I have we're all doing this so Bernie isn't facing Leo. I mean, no, it's to make sure that she's safe out here. It's it's also just. I'm the one who has the ability to use things at a distance. You guys don't. Right. You, you, just have her with, you can just have her withdraw if you're so concerned. I don't. She's not going to withdraw because she's so confident. She, she is so confident. Leo. Well, there are ways to forcefully withdraw people. We're not. There's a really bad joke I want to insert here, but I'm I not going to do I it. I have the ability to count their spells. If he uses uh. anything like that, I can stop it. But at the same time, you understand that that's going to put an even bigger target on us. To put a target on you. It's also going to put a target on Bernie because he doesn't even notice her. And Faye is going to get in trouble. And that's Faye only if things go gonna wrong. Faye also get in big trouble. Well, even if they don't go wrong. Then why don't she and I go talk to Ken? Why don't you all pull out of the competition? No. Mm -mm. I get, this up. is... This is just a theory. This is just a question. Would that be if possible? It's not impossible. Should we talk to Kin first? 
Uh, How like angry would he be if, if that happened? Hitmaster would be. He doesn't, you know, like when I mess with time, he says that I can screw things up. And like, question, we're not supposed to be able to not. say his name, right? You're not. You and Flair cannot. Oh, yeah. yeah. Cyrus and, and, and Scent can because we weren't, we weren't branded. Yeah. No deals right. were made. Oh, I yeah. Yeah. Okay. Nope. No. We didn't, we didn't uh, have that curse placed on us. So. What, what I'm saying yeah. is, it's not messing with time, it's me in isolation There was, going back. you know, I, I was able to, you know, control time in the necklace with Abby and drain mm. him, but that was only because, you know, Abby got some extra energy from Big Bro. Okay. But... I'm gonna flop his arms. It's all gone. <laughs> Yeah. If you don't think that this is something that should be done, then I won't do it. But it's a, it's a, it's, in it's dangerous. Mm. Cyrus. Yes. Why did you sign up to this tournament? In the first well, place. Because uh, I said it was a good idea. Yes. I told him it was a bad idea. And I took Faye's word over his. <gasps> and that's unfortunate. Because Faye, in her words, said that it could have a positive effect on Leo's palace for us. Because it could. Because it actually could. Depending on what could happen, if I were to fight him, I come out on top. I both rattle him by showing him that I'm still alive, in a sense. I mean, if Bernie gets in humbled, it just means that she's going to train school. harder. That's not the point. What? It might... It, you're, you're right. It might, it might be okay. But it's that... That realm of possibility. If you think it's better to just have Kin be there, just in case things go sour, then I would rather that happen. And I'm saying, just if we can somehow work out swapping Bernie and I's placements in the bracket, no time travel involved if we can help it. Hmm. Well, see, here's the thing. So if we go talk to Big Bro now, by the time we get back out here, the first round's going to be ready to start. So what? we can't afford to leave. <clears throat> then why don't you and I just go and if we don't make it back then we don't make it back well Cyrus just said that he probably should fight Leo for the sake of his palace but mm. would Barney could humble him too you never know I mean, if we just have we just I bribe want the people who made the brackets I mean money <laughs> works around here works for me at least mm -hmm. it's great Ever, if you weren't here for this and I know to an extent you're being optimistic, which I get and I appreciate. But Leo is deceptively strong. And we don't I'm know how we strong to he's switch gotten. the brackets. You don't have to use magic. I'm, yeah. I, again, I'm trying to explain our concern, okay? We don't know how strong Leo's gotten since he killed me, okay? We know he can use some power. We don't know if he's gotten stronger physically as well as magically. You're, you're worried about everyone in the competition, not just Bernie. Well, hmm. what, if, what if we... I mean, I don't want to throw anybody else under the bus, but what if we what if we do, you know, try to bad somebody and bribe Bernie out of that place and maybe make him go up against, like, Athos or something? I'll do that. Yeah, oh because surely... In a school contest, Leo's not going to just start massacring people in no. front of a live audience. He would maybe massacre less. one, being, he's sort of like hint over at Cyrus, not his head. But like <laughs> everyone else, maybe not. My... So he won't kill anybody, but if Well, he... you, maybe, but... Harming I mean, anyone close to us is a thing, he... that's all. He won't kill, but it doesn't mean he won't maim or debilitate anybody there's no explicit rules against accidental bone mm -hmm. breakage he could cripple somebody to be fair out of anybody in this bracket that I'm looking at Athos and Barney have a better chance than anyone so... Cyrus That's how ready are you to face Leo as ready as I'll ever be so we bribe them to switch you with Bernie, and hopefully, mm. you can outmatch him before he can get to anybody else. And then if things go south, we, all of us jump I out, call, and we just go in. 
Mm-hmm. Are you sure a first round matchup with him is a good idea? If I don't fight him in the first round, I could be a lot weaker come the next. But oh. he might also be a lot stronger still. Mm-hmm. And you'll be fighting him at full strength. If he fights so, people, he'll be worn out. How about this? Why don't we swap Let's Athos try and, and Bernie? Let's the brackets. To sp- I agree. We can swap Athos and Bernie. And then swap me and Noah's opponent. I go up against Noah. If I beat him, and go against a probably Why don't you go in the bracket below that? And then you can get into the... Round three. You could fight him in the third round instead. That's if I manage to get to the third round. I don't know well, who I'm going up against. Look from Rinko back to the rest of them and be like, Hey, I have a wacky idea. What if before the fight starts... We slipped him something. Leo? Yeah. How subtle were you being at looking over at Rinko? You'd Scent would notice. <laughs> okay. 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 Gr- Grin's gonna pop up on his face. Yeah, Grin's gonna pop up on his face. Wow, the pacifist <laughs> flair with an idea like that. Hmm. Well, if we hmm. slip him something, then switching Ethos and Bernie is all we really need to do. Sure. Let's mm-hmm. give it a go. I don't know. Yeah. Money and drugs. What more does the world need? <laughs> I still say. Oh, well. <laughs> I still say, as a safety precaution, put me in the same bracket. You'll, just in case, because you'll be the safety concern. Let, then is what's going to happen. Yeah, if, I understand. My safety concern, regardless, is going to be in this tournament. Who knows? If I were to make it to the finals on my side of the bracket, Leo could make it too. How about There's this? No guarantee any of us could beat him. How about this? We'll focus on Athos and Bernie first. Swap yeah. them, and then we'll see about you getting swapped. Because that's going to be asking for two things mm-hmm. from this bracket. That's going to be very difficult. And if we really want to get devious... From a bracket could... that's already posted and people are looking at. Mm-hmm. Not to mention that, uh, you know, we should probably conceal the fact that you're alive as long as we can. Mm-hmm. And until the point where we need you to actually face him, we should avoid that this as a possibility. This is like a school thing, too, by the way. Mm-hmm. This isn't like... A necessary evil right that we need Swap- to conquer swapping one placement could just be oh we made a mistake no big deal swapping two though i mean we could knock out farley and phelan and they could be in the back alley for a little bit and then oh my gosh there's a spot open and oh raven you don't have anyone to face and boop, they put you over there but you know that's just hypothetical stuff i wouldn't do that or have anyone I mean, I'm not opposed to that. that. Claire's would, eyes are just going <laughs> to narrow not at that. him. Let's not do underhand, that's, that's that not underhanded that tactics. Doing that at all, but like, you know, just I, might say. Let's not do that. I'm not opposed in the sense of maybe, you know, putting them you to You want to take out a competition? Why don't, why don't we not do that? I, Anyways, hypothetical guys. Hypothetical. Is it a the reason why I'm so <laughs> stubborn about this can, can sit, look around and just see if there's anybody like looking at us because we've <laughs> yeah, been talking for check. a while make a perception check yeah, yeah, yeah i would i would love to do this yeah Sixteen. yeah i mean people are passing by and just like kind of looking weirdly at your group there are people walking up to the bracket and kind of like looking over at your anyone of circle at all uh With no one specific no okay no. okay is Sink going to make it public knowledge to the rest of the group that people are kind of staring? He's going to kind of like, he's going to kind of look around and just kind of like get this like look of concern on his face and just kind of just like more stand up straight and kind of just keep people watching while you guys are talking because he can't really contribute much anymore. So, yeah. Cool. Um, like Sarah was saying, uh, the reason why I'm being so stubborn is because I don't trust Leo. Okay, I understand we're trying to preserve the fact that I'm still alive, but he'll find out one way or another. Even during the Fire Festival, me being here is already technically a huge danger to my own safety. Yes. And... As much as I'm hiding, and... Yeah, maybe signing up for the martial arts tournament was a bad idea. 
Hindsight's 2020. But unfortunately, uh, I think our priorities okay. have to shift. Money and drugs. Let's do this, guys. Break. Yeah. <laughs> let's let's start here. I'll talk to Rinko. Oh, right. <laughs> Don't. I would not count it out that Leo would be playing extra safe. It's Let's Rinko, though. try and see if we can't get me put in against Noah and swap Athos by drugging our opponents. Well, maybe we should try just switching Athos and Bernie I think so, first too. and then leave it at that because I think Scent was onto something. If you're asking for one thing, you know, okay, sure. But then you're asking for two things. That's that's suspicious. A bit. One thing is just could be like, hey, we made a mistake. They're ma Le 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 you could even just say like Leo and Bernie have bad chemistry from the in the past. And so them going against each other may not be the best of ideas. Mm hmm. That's as, as simple as that. Excuses aren't Hold the best. Hold on a second. Money is the best. Hold on. I'm not saying money's not going to be used. Ever. Uh, let me yep. go with Bernie. And sure. You have. Sorry. Go ahead, Finch. I, I'll go with Bernie and Sint, and we'll try to convince the organizers to swap the bracket, and then Before I'll talk to that. Rin. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. do you still have your disguise kit? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you'd never ask. Can I borrow it? I can. I can. Well, you want me to make up you? I can. I can work with no, this. I, I just, kind of like just, shimmy around. Just, I know how to put makeup and stuff on thanks to my time in theater. Uh, can I borrow it? And uh, let's see if I can't pass myself off as one of the staff members who messed up on the bracket. Oh. I misprinted it. Question to DM. Am I proficient in my disguise kit? Does that give me any bonus? Proficiency just allows you to use your proficiency when you're oh, okay. rolling for it. Um, yeah, all right. I'm going to just... I guess I just have a bag on me like a fanny pack. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it'd, it'd be oh, in your tools. With this kit, it lets you add your proficiency bonus to any ability checks you make. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it'd be in your tools. Uh, in the proficiency. Yeah, yeah no, I see it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, you sure you know how to use these? He's gonna kind of hand it over. I mean, yeah, I could I mean, fix you I up real practice. quick. I know how to make a quick costume change. Okay, yeah. <laughs> uh, where's the nurse bathroom? I'll go in there and uh. Easy enough to find. This is hilarious. Oh. I'm sorry. This is so fucking funny to me. <laughs> uh, we're we're about to wrap up session, but before we'll do this scene and then we'll then we'll yeah, stop yeah, playing because yeah. I know it's getting yep. fairly on the light side cool. um yep. performance you want me to roll the performance check roll a performance check yeah we'll do see do i get advantage because of my actor feet just because sure I have it? yeah let's go uh damn 21 not bad, bad. Yeah. Not whole bad. new person cool you'll see wow. cyrus come out like his hair is like a totally different color uh, from his black. Uh, we'll say he he convincingly turned it blonde. Amazingly, you know, pair, amazingly, amazingly yeah. turns it turned it blonde. Has a pair of glasses on, some like big round frames. Uh, totally different co uh, like outfit on as mm -hmm. opposed to what he was wearing before. It's like a little matching more like, the staff. Yeah, and everything like that. And he comes out and just kind of looks to you guys and be like, "So how do I look?" Boy, that's that's you. Who oh, is this person talking to us? I... I think this is... Wait, who are you? Raven? Yes, Raven. Oh. Wink, mm. wink. Uh, I, I know we'll oh, see Ra everywhere. Raven. You, okay. I never... Okay. Uh, but great You look job. good in makeup. Thank you. Does, Thank does you. he not look good regular? I mean, he I has his moments. I will just to take the compliment. Anyways... <laughs> Here's here's the here's my idea. Here's my plan, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I look like the staff. I can walk in. See if I can't convince them like that I was in charge of printing it. I made a total mistake. And I need to fix it. Oh, you can use your 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 performance. I heard exactly. you killed it. Exactly. So, so kill them with your I performance. Can, yeah. I'm not killing anybody, but No, no, visually. Yeah, sure. Uh, that analogy makes total sense. Uh, mm. I'll go in, 
I'll say Athos and Bernice were supposed to swap, and I can put myself not directly after Athos, but I can put myself in the correct bracket. Small mistakes. If anybody gets none the wiser. Wait, aren't we? Isn't the plan to change not you, but the other person? I'll be further down in the same bracket, side of the bracket, okay? So uh, go, go like round three. Do the first That's one first, and then see what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I will put myself so that way if, if I do what if, if Raven performs well, then Pace is Leo round three. Okay? So what's your name now? Because it can't be Raven. Um, Faye. Huh? Fun name. Uh -huh. Charming. Charming it is. <laughs> Samuel Charming. <laughs> Sam Charm. I had to go. Oh, yes. I thought, I thought, never mind. Well, Samuel, Sa Charm. Samuel no, Charm. No, 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 no. There you go. Samuel please Charm. Please Your please name is Samuel, Samuel Charm. Charm. No, I thought Samuel you were calling Black. yourself Faye. No, I wasn't. I was asking your opinion. Oh, well, Samuel Charming. Samuel Charming it is. <laughs> nice. <laughs> cool. I'll say it was a last minute addition added onto the team and that I was in charge and there was a huge mistake. My blunder, uh, have the correct placement in mind, and see if what I can accomplish. Okay, and I'll go talk to Rinko. And break. And break. And Let's break. go, team. And then Cyrus break. will start walking off, and as he's starting to walk off, he's going to mm -hmm. build himself up a little bit, try to get the right, get in the right headspace to play as Sam Charming. Yep, so you make your way into the staff area where the, um, the martial arts staff is working um and you find your way into that area what are you doing so as we're entering this area uh sam charming samuel charming <sighs> is gonna be really out of breath like he's gonna prior to going there he's gonna like kind of mess up his uniform just a little bit like mm -hmm. you know shirts tucked in untucked like half of it and he's gonna like come in like i'm so sorry there's been a mistake hmm? what's going on the bracket's wrong. We the need to get it fixed wrong? now. I was yeah. about the wrong. I made a mistake. I was in, I was in charge, of, of printing it, and putting everything together. We've got people on total opposite ends that wasn't intended. Uh, that's not good. Um. Yeah, really not good. Well, we already posted it, so can't we just leave it? I mean, that's some extra work. Do you really, really want to know what could happen if they find out that there was a mistake during the fire festival, during the martial arts tournament? There's still time. We can get oh. it fixed. I know exactly what needs to be changed, okay? It's literally it's such a small it's such a small change. It's just two people need to be swapped. They were on opposite ends. It was late at night. Just just sorry. Oh, do you have a glass of water or something? I I sprinted over. Yeah. To the uh, one, one, one second. Um, and he walks over and he gets uh gets you a drink of water. The rest of you, while you were standing outside, you see Leo Sheen and me approaching the big top tent. Yeah. Sense gonna since gonna kind of walk on over to to Bernie and just mm -hmm. uh just kind of like regroup with the other group. Okay. And uh just kind of. How are you feeling about the fights uh, at the moment, uh, Bernie? I feel good. I think I'm gonna be just fine. You think you could, uh, you think you could, uh, you know, kick Leo's ass? I think so. Yeah? Hmm. I mean, he is deceptively strong, so you never know. I'm deceptively strong. You do got a point there. I mean, if you can, you know, do that thing you did with Athos to him, I mean... Doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, I believe it. Um, Leo walks right by you guys. He'll, like, lift his head up and kind of, like, look over at Leo. And just, just, kinda just, just give him a look. Doesn't seem to acknowledge you. It, he's, uh, he's holding a piece of paper in his hand. Um, like he's on some sort of business. Can I get a glance at the paper? Uh, yeah, make a perception hidden? check. Sure. I mean, he's not, like, exactly hiding it, but sure. make a perception check. He's moving. Also, quick question for you, Dash, and while that nope. that's going. Yes. Uh, no. 
would it be just just so I have it in my mind for when we return to Cyrus? Uh, it would be like Ace, uh, Keltrix, Casper, and Cross Fallside that I would need to specifically be mine for to be round three to face Leo, right? That um, could be for, is it be round for one, round, round three? It would be Rosalind, Milani, uh, Milana, Kellith, Perry. Oh, round three is the the blue. Yeah. Oh wait. Oh, I thought uh, round, round one, round two. Yeah, round three is the red. Yeah, that's what I thought. So it'd be yeah, Ace, Casper, so. Frost, and Keltrix. That you would are be. correct. Yep. Okay, cool. You Just one clarification. Yep. I'm misreading the bracket, not you. It's all good. <laughs> no, trust it's, it's it's still confusing me when I look back at it anyways. Yep. Yep. Uh Scent does not notice the paper. Like no. doesn't see anything. It's a quick like flash away. He like sees like, oh, yep. he's holding something. That's it. Is mm. my passive perception do anything? No, it doesn't. <laughs> I mean someone... you could have called out to do a perception check, but too late now. How how are his eyes on that paper where really? like it's he, he was just no, he was just uh kind of like flashing up to look at it and then he looked back down to keep walking where he's watching. No, he's already gone. Yeah. He was just I walking. Can I look at his ass? No, okay, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Can I look at his ass? <laughs> got a nice ass. Nice. Good. Nice firm. Yeah, I will out. say is you do you yeah. do have a tight ass. Been yeah. working out. Wait, what? Right how do you yeah. know that as his best friend? What's going on there? Bro, you don't look at your homies' point. asses? Uh-huh. That's Come on. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, oh, back inside Cyrus Samuel Charming. Uh, words. The uh the guy gets you a glass of water and he says, All right, relax. Um we can get this fixed. Um Leo doesn't even need to know we already printed the wrong bracket. Uh, okay. That's fine. So easy fix. Easy so, fix. All right, I'm getting the paper right now. And he walks over and he draws up the brackets again and he starts writing the correct names. Um, and he says, all right, and now which portion did you say we needed to fix again? So, Athos on the right side of the bracket, who was Athos. originally going up against... I have a character, I'm looking for it. Yeah. No links. Yeah. Supposed to be going up against Leo. Leo Shinami. Okay. And... The last change is that Raven uh -huh. is, supp is supposed to be going up against Keltrix. So we need to swap Ace and Raven. So Raven will be facing against Farley Dayton. All right. Easy, easy enough. He begins filling in the bracket and a few seconds pass. Gen, Gen, are you here? Walking in, you hear and see Leo, and Gen stops and looks over. Oh, Leo, um, wasn't expecting you this early. And uh, Leo smiles and says, Of course, I'd be here. The martial arts tournament, the most important tournament of this festival, alongside the, you know, the dance stuff, whatever. Uh, who are you? Pointing at you. Oh, sorry. I haven't had the chance to properly meet you. I've been so busy with work. Uh, Sam, Sam. Doesn't, it doesn't matter. Uh, I saw the bracket. Beautiful job. And um, Jen, like, looks nervously at you. About that, sir. Um, there's actually two small mistakes on the bracket that my fault and I wanted to try to correct them. For... Two small mistakes. Yes. There was uh there were no mistakes. Excuse me? I created the bracket myself. Uh oh. <laughs> hey yo, sent you hearing this shit, dog? <laughs> Hey, yo, how you ears feeling over there, man? Oh, he doesn't hear shit. Ears? He's too far away. He's this too is, far this away. This is in the tent. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, it depends on how loud Leo's being. He's not that loud. Nope. I know he's boisterous, but he ain't loud. And Gen just kind of raises an eyebrow and he says, Oh, then we're all good. Whew. Oh, wow. You really had me worried there, Sam. <laughs> and he turns around and crumples up the, the new paper and... uh Leo walks over and takes the crumpled paper out of Gen's hands and unfurls it. 
Now, what is this change? That's not what I had in mind at all. No, no. We're keeping it as is. No changes to my bracket. But, sir, I, I, I assure you that... I assure you that... There was one small mistake. And I was simply trying to correct it. And I'm telling you, there is no mistake. And he reaches into his breast pocket and takes out a piece of paper and hands it to you. And it is the same exact bracket that you saw out front. This, this isn't what I saw when he became to have me help print it. Hmm. Well, looks like the mistake was correct after all. So good job, everybody. I am so proud of you, but that's not why I'm here right now. Um, we are going to need some VIP seating. The headmistress is attending the entire tournament. Uh oh. Yeah, Avar shit himself on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> None of us can hear this. Flair just feels a cold <laughs> wind to run through. None of us hear this shit. Um, I'm going on vacation, guys. <laughs> she will be seated next to the Pontifex for the entire tournament. Oh, shit. Cyrus is keeping totally in character, but internally, literally, is fuming. <laughs> Understood, sir. We'll make sure that it happens. Yes. Increased guard because one of her deacons are taking part in this tournament, Mr. Noah Astor, which is why I put him in the potential second round matchup against his very prince. Gave the Pontifex in this academy something to watch, something to cheer for. It's smart thinking, sir. Extremely smart thinking. Thank you. Um, before you leave, uh, yes. I understand that your your bracket is set in stone, and I apologize for the confusion. Uh, I do want to bring to your attention that on my way over here, I I had heard some some rumors about a potential combatant that might make for a good show. <laughs> A potential combatant that might make for a good show. Do tell. It's the contestant Raven. Mm -hmm. I've the uh, sword user. Yes, yeah, sword and shield user. Uh -huh. I've I've heard tell that he's quite strong. Quite strong. Huh? Quite strong. And if you truly wish to make quite the impression, that maybe you should. Face him instead. Swords clashing against swords. What better way to start the tournament? <laughs> Make a persuasion check. Ooh. At advantage because I am passing myself off as somebody else. True. It's true. Okay, that okay. Actor feed thing? Yeah, it's an actor thing. Actor feed. Yeah. Uh, cool. Okay. Ooh. That is a 22. Ooh. Okay, very cool. Very cool. Oh, I think my shit froze. Hang on. Oh. No, it's, it's, it's just D&D &D Beyond. Oh, okay, okay, okay. all right. Ah. 22. He yep. looks at you and a cold smile cracks across his face. A good show. And he looks at Gen and he says, give me two seconds with our new addition. And uh, again, nods and he uh, walks across to the other side of the room and like puts like a head, like uh, almost like earmuffs on. So like he can't hear and, and like kind of huddle like into the corner. Like he's trying to just like not see what's going on or hear what's going on at all. Um, it's honestly a little strange looking. And uh, Leo leans into you. And he says, no, 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 no. I want to face you in the finals, Cyrus. Uh, Cyrus? You mean like the the vice president's squire? That's... 
Come on now. You don't think I would recognize my brother from anywhere? After hearing that, Cyrus is just going to totally drop character. Eyebrows furrowed, staring daggers, fiery daggers straight at Leo. You want to know what the funny part about this whole thing, brother, is that there is nothing that you're going to be able to do to stop me from doing what I want until you fight me yourself. One on one, no interference. <laughs> Oh, what fun we're going to have. And don't worry. I have my insurance. Yeah, maybe you should up your policy for when I kick your damn ass in the finals. You're gonna need it. <sighs> I guess we'll see. I'll see you in the finals, brother. And with that, Cyrus is going to just turn tail and not turn tail, but he's gonna, you know, the dramatic sort of like flare of like, you know, he turns around. If he had a like a flowing right. shirt or cape, it would like kind of like tuft around. Mm -hmm. And he'll walk out, fists balled. Okay. And you can. And that is where we are going to end game. Wait. For what? What's up? Can I? I want to, before this session ends. Yeah. Can I try? <laughs> no, come on, man. What do you mean, come <laughs> on? He said, hours. I could, he said I could do it. <laughs> yeah, but I'm, I want to sprint over there and at least try it one more time before the session ends. You know what? Yeah, sure. You know, you're feeling oh, mighty confident. You make your way Bernie's back over. Me. Can Flair uh, do it too? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, you and Flair make Let's your go. way over there. Yeah, wild. And uh, you want to take another shot at the test of strength. Go for it. Is this before or after Flair has a conversation with Rinko? Uh, we'll we'll say before. You guys were feeling spicy when Cyrus was going to do his uh thing before before Leo made his way over there. You're yeah. like, hey, we, we got a we got a quick natural. we got a quick second. Yeah. So you guys right. sprint it over and you're going to do this test of strength. Is it just Avrif and Flair? Unless anybody else went with you guys, but... Nope. Okay. Then it's just okay. Avrif and Flair. Make All it right. strength. Strength check. Base strength. Go for it. I'm gonna I'm I'm get encouraged by you. God. You step up to the plate first. You're gonna let no. Avrif go first. Yeah, you go uh, first. Are you but... sure it's me, Flair? Yeah. I mean, it's Flair. I mean, Come in on. character, it would make guess. sense for Flair to want you to go first because she doesn't want to be like... You know, she feels kind of achy around you. Yeah, Flair's just gonna, as soon as you're like, oh, are you sure, are you sure? She's just gonna shoot you daggers. <laughs> and they're they're even more piercing now because of the, her eyes are way more ferocious. Uh... Ooh, oh my 19. God. Okay. Finally, something. But, but. Ooh. What's but? You never know. What are we buddy? But. 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 What, what? Okay. In the butt. Flare roll. No. Go for it. Okay. Can I just use my roll from before? <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Ah, Fangulo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Flare did not have it today. No. Makes sense. She did yeah. just die the last night, so. True. Oh. Yeah, Can she look at Avarif and try again and give it a oh real good swing? Oh yeah. my god, we're not, this we're is an ethnic measuring contest. We're not doing what? this. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> you have to hurry back because uh, Leo is perfectly on his way, so you had to act natural with the rest of the group. Oh yeah. Um, um, oh, so she yeah. can't, she right. can't dra drag... No. I we'll, do it next drag time. we'll do it next time. We'll do it next time. Come on, Flair. No, no, we gotta go back. What I'm... Well, question no, though, Dashing. Hmm. Did Avarath oh. win or not? What are you saying? Yes, Avarath did win. Yes, Avarath did I win. I can get a plushie. Yes, you can. You know a reindeer, a penguin, a unicorn, or a quavy. 
Like you said, like a koi bee is like a a, a koi it's fish. It's a long furby. I hate everything. <laughs> uh, fuck. Is there a fish? No. No. Damn Reindeer, like penguin. penguin. Okay. Nice. But that was that's one of the lower prizes. Is it the, uni the unicorn yeah, and the koi bee are the big ones? The, the big ones. Oh man! Has anyone got the unicorn yet or no? Yeah. Uh, Yep. All, all the prizes have been claimed. Bur Bur Bernie, Bernie has it in her room that sent one. And Cyrus okay. has a probably slightly barfed on Koyabi. Uh, okay, I'll take the fucking unicorn. Hmm. All right. Yoink. And you can refresh your page because I updated your strength. Yippee. Dude, that fucking... I, I don't know if I've ever had like that many rolls that... Uh, I'm about to tweak. It happens, dude. Hmm. <laughs> well, are you done now? Uh, yes. Now we are actually done. That's where okay, we okay. are in game for tonight. Goodbye, stream. Bye, everybody. I love you. Bye, bye, bye. Oh. Bye.